Welcome to episode 384 of Fans of Power. I'm Nathan Kennedy, and rounding out the crew tonight, we have Tyler Baker, Joe Amato, audio only tonight, the man of two Fs, the trash man, Ren McKenzie, and of course, the, the doctor is in, and Jason Mitrovic. Two Fs, food and farting, right? Food and farting. <laughs> no, that's, yeah, that's yeah. Joe. That, that that's, will be Joe's two Fs, That's yeah. Joe's two Fs, <laughs> not, not, uh, not Ren's. Rebecca may be here uh not entirely sure but she may join us later on and ren we, we only got ren for like the next 45 ish minutes so we're, we're gonna have to get to the topic way quicker than than we normally do or nobody will miss me or we just shoot the shit for this first little bit and then when ren leaves then we do the topic yeah because you don't know what the fuck's going on with this comic so it's like fuck it there we go <laughs> who was that it's the ghost head. <laughs> it's the it's cold as shit in that room upstairs. I was like, I just couldn't do it up there, and I don't want to do this uh, video in my living room or anywhere else. It's so plain and bland. So I was like, ah, it's audio mode. Oh, oh come on, you are you did it already before. In nobody I, I, mind. I, as as Tyler was saying, I, I think he just doesn't want us to see the bodies. Because uh, yeah, <laughs> well, I mean, I, I mean, as much as he is so passive, like he's like ignore the blood here. You know, like I, 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 I know, like the, the his his fan base would completely ignore. Mm -hmm. you know, oh my God! Look at the body. Nothing you know, to see here, please. Yeah. It'll be like right. our spawn conversation. Yeah, there's finger the, paintings all finger over the wall. You know? Yeah. And what we'd pull that like in uh, Naked Gun, Tyler. Nothing to see here, please. This yes. <laughs> absolutely. And you, you, you've got you know. Oh my God! I could see Joe like feeding wild animals with like people's you know body parts and shit like that. You know, <laughs> I mean, I mean, it just it just it, it just can't help it. Anytime you see like, you know, just like when I was watching the movie Blowout that Nathan recommended, the opening is this really shitty horror movie. This weirdo is like peeking in the windows, like it's Joe Amato. Yeah, you know, no, that's just, what I thought when I watched it. The first time. I'm like, yeah, there, this, this is this is absolutely Joe. But if we're not seeing him tonight, but if you want to know what joe amato is looking like current day there you go he's having a bad day yeah he's, that, that's, that's why he's, he's falling apart this is what the cold weather does to this poor guy what he's the a moisturizer buddy he's cheap oh yeah. is that the actual original et that fell apart yes or something or what? Yeah. yes no mm -hmm. shit he's just like with those uh ninja turtles costumes yeah oh yeah it's not built to last or the, the Jaws, uh, Jaws uh, sharks that were used for the movies that just fall apart after time. Well, because I mean, when they're making that stuff, they're not thinking in their their mind like, "Oh, th th this." Hey, is, it's uh, just for this movie, and yeah, never more. Yeah, yeah. But also, um, we got that. God damn it! 
Th Who's this, leg, is, whose leg is that Joe. right there? This was I the think that's Nick Mayetta, right? This Maybe? Was... Or no. It, wait, wait, whoever this, it is has lady shoes on. I was going to say, it's, it looks like a woman's leg with... Hey, don't you know? Uh, what, what Joe oh, does in his spare time? Don't worry. About I don't. Well, I guess if Joe is that me that choking mean, him, how did who photoshopped that shit? Because that somebody is me. The body. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of okay, I don't know whose body that is, but uh. What the hell? That I mean, so I know good. whose body that is. Yeah. Oh god. Well, mm. Is that you, Dushin? Did you do that shit? Did you do that yeah. Photoshop work? Because yeah, oh god, this is, yeah. this is uh, Photoshop. It's a genuine photo. Look at it. Yes, yeah, it's, it's artificial intelligence. This is what AI is capable of. Oh, it's wow. AI because everything there is me. The the head, the <laughs> right arm, you know and the you know legs. It is you. You know. No, happened? no, not the <laughs> the AI. The AI mistook the part of the chair as a skirt. That's why it came. Oh. To the I see. I see. Yeah, you know, we don't judge Poor it for wearing women's shoes, though. Don't don't worry about that. <laughs> yeah, that is fine. creepy. That's cool. It's Joe, like Henry you... Winkler and the Water Boy. Exactly. You are in a safe space. Yeah. Also, for some reason, it is... keeps giving you tattoos. Yeah. I really? think you should get yeah, that. that. I think you should get that, Joe. That'd be pretty bad. Uh, no, no, no tattoos. No and, tattoos. It looks like it tried to give you a scarf ish thing. Yeah. 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 I'm trying to look at that. That's uh. That's wild. <laughs> it's just creepy. That's I, weird I shit. Show, uh, the tattoo would look great on your no. skin. Can, can on your Joe skin. Over cash for a quality tattoo? Joe would go to some back alley like tattoo artist and get hepatitis. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, and he, would, he would look like that. You, you can't give Joe something he already Jenny. has. You can't get hepatitis twice, can you? <laughs> I don't know. Joe, Joe, Joe's the first for everything. Yeah. Or he, he would look like this, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah <look. laughs> Goddamn Deucin. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Well, Joe, you uh <laughs> you've received your attorney a place that you have unboxed that you sent me a couple of videos. How how are you feeling yeah. about how the, the job that they did with it compared to the vintage set? Oh no, no. I mean, well, the vintage one still has always had the biggest place in my heart, but no, they did a fantastic job. This thing is bigger. I showed videos where it's it has more functionality and other features. And it has a mini like, comic. You know, I I looked at the cover and I was like, it looked like a three year old drew that shit. I was like, I ain't fucking reading mm. that. that. That was a hot looking mess there. But um, at least for Tyler, I know Tyler would appreciate this because remember Tyler, we always talk about, about Viper Tower. Well, Viper Tower, you know, we always talk about it and you're like, all it does is the head turns. And I was like, yeah, yeah. it's supposed to act like, you know, it's supposed to be a periscope. Well, this one now, not only turning, but there's a, a feature where you grab on the lever and it strikes down and its mouth open, like it open and it actually is a feature. It's like, huh? Hmm. So they, they added something I, to that. I, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. It's, just, I, I, it's cool. Look, it's cool looking, but I did tell Jen, I was like, I'd never use it because I'd be afraid. Oh, what are you supposed to do when they're going around the track, hit the thing and bust everything? But it looks cool. But um, the Grayskull Tower is bigger for the cage area and the arms of the attorney of play set. Now it's like in a different position and they swing and like swivel yeah. to grab to pull in. And they yeah, also it, have. Instead of doing this, it kind of, it, it like. It like turns and then yeah, yeah. It, it looked, it and looked then, pretty good in the video. That yeah, and and a new for the uh the drawbridge. There's like a booby trap. You hit one of the griffins, and boom, it'll like flip whoever's there trying to enter like off of that. So they did add a lot. It it is really cool. Came with a cool uh type of prism holographic prism folder or folder folder or poster. <laughs> God damn, I can't even say it. Poster. Folder. <laughs> Folder, whatever the fuck I'm Folder. trying to, I'm making new words. And then, yeah. of course, the moat monster. I love that little bastard. He's so photogenic. And I put him in there and did a, a photo. And then, of course, Dushin <laughs> fucking did that. <laughs> he said that was what Jen said. Like, uh, like that was her reaction. She seen me and I'm yelling like, Jenny, it's me, Joe. Wait, don't run. That was the first time she met me. But I did have an idea. Ah. Yeah. I had an idea, though, for that photo. Um, we'll remove what, the text on it. What, this one? Uh, no, the uh, <laughs> one with the moat monster. Oh, yeah. I said it into our uh, our group chat. Uh, you might have missed it. it. Uh, 
Oh, no, okay. Yeah, I was going to say, we'll get rid of the text, and we're going to have like a little contest for everybody that's watching, listening now. We'll run it for maybe a couple weeks. You go to our Fans of Power Facebook group, and you just fill in the caption with whatever you want, whatever funny caption, clever caption you want, and we'll judge, decide who's the funniest or the best, and they'll win a copy of the Power and Honor Foundation. Oh, 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 shit. oh, whatever, dude. <laughs> what the fuck ever, man. Yeah. So I was waiting for him to sit there and say, as he's looking at that pile of 80 books there, I, I promise I'll get to the post office someday. Just like, what he means is sometime and maybe in, in your lifetime, you will receive a, an artifact from my house. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Anyways, we'll 60 to, 60 we'll to 80 to he's, make he's, like, yeah. he's like to deliver it all, but it all got frozen. <laughs> so, you, like I said, you oh. go to our group. We'll put the picture up. Nathan will take care to put the photo up. You download it, fill it in with whatever caption you want. We'll vote on the best, and then but, the winner gets uh, a copy. How, how about next week? I'll, I will show uh, the blank version of it, and then we'll uh, we'll we'll do we'll get that kind of the ball rolling on that next. Yeah, week. And get people uh -huh. like a week or two, however long we want, just a couple weeks, and then just uh, see them posting and putting there in the group. How many copies of that are you sitting on currently? No, I, I can't. Well, I'm. I'm he needs he's a not, he, yeah. to sell. <laughs> he's not shipped out a fucking copy. Not one. Not I, one. I, I, we shipped out a. I've shipped out a bunch. So Easily double, double digits, out. right? Bullshit, man. Double digits. It's over ten, right? Yeah. See, so we're gonna be shipping out more. Believe, and I don't believe that for a second. No and we're gonna about way. to. It'll give out to See, everybody. look, Joe's even laughing. He knows we're calling out on this bullshit here. <laughs> no, I'm not letting lot. Joe slide on this. We let him slide I on did. so much. Like, I've, no. I've shipped about seven of them. I honestly, about seven uh, of them. Yeah, I knew it. I fucking knew it. I was surprised to see that. How long, though? Because this has been like eight years. Hey, we kind of, I just forgot. It ain't been no eight years, but I'm going to go. Oh, yeah. Joe's so busy, you know, running his <laughs> Fortune 500 company and everything. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to get the rest out this year, I promise. But let me yeah. say hello yeah. to the chat. Yeah. We got uh -huh. Will, Tim, Will Timson, Fedmon, say it, Nathan. Johnny Cock. Did he Zinch. say Wilton? Uh, no, I said Will he Timson. He said Wilton Simpson. Shut up. Um, Zentron, uh, son of a bitch. Let's see. Uh, Rebel Wookie. Is that is that guy um, new, to the pot, new to the chat room? <laughs> Hold son on of a bitch second, is here. Hey, son that's of a bitch. Son of a bitch. <laughs> JSP, Daniel Carhunen, Sean Darren, Adam Gabbert, um, uh, Daniel Car. Oh, I think I said Daniel I like Carhunen bugs. already. <laughs> Papa Hut sixty nine. <laughs> um, um, John Ballard. Of power. Hey Shut Joe, up. what's your favorite color, Joe? <laughs> Mick DJ, um, Thompson Farm. I like purple um, myself. Pissed off. <laughs> Stop. Omega I like blue and black too. And um, I think I got Xbox 9088. Yeah, sometimes if, he calls himself the Traveler. If I miss anybody, <laughs> the, I really? <laughs> like the Iceman too? And yeah. Oh my god. Huh. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, yeah, shit. why don't you call Centron a son of a bitch, Joe? <laughs> no, that just happened. <laughs> hey, you bastard. <laughs> oh, my God. No, that Joe's was a rude dude when, it, when he's not facing you. Yeah. So yeah you know, I, I, I have half a mind since Joe isn't here showing his face. I do have a photo that I did a screenshot on my phone when Joe and I were playing. Uh, no, you Mar didn't. Mario oh, I saw that. Nathan sent it to me, too. Yeah. Did you? Don't yeah, you, you know, you know where like shit. both of us are like this. We're looking at each other. And we're like, yeah. I screenshotted that. So I, I should just put it on the screen. Right? Don't, yeah, don't, I've never seen Joe look any happier than he was in that picture. I think he was yeah. more happier there than he was at PowerCon. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> I don't even remember. But what's out? Outmate music. He's here in the chat. But don't yeah, don't share that shit. Uh, but I have fun playing with Nathan and uh, kicking the shit out of him sometimes in Mario Kart. He's he's See, all right. At first, it just doesn't really sound that good. Oh, that didn't sound good playing yeah. with Nathan. Yeah, that was um yeah, then, competing uh, with Nathan. That's how you like you play with there. Brand too. And how I, do I always get brand in the middle? That's how you end up here and you and you end up here and you yeah. end up here. And Joe's two S with Ren is fingering and fucking. Shoes, man. And, and then you end up here and then there. Oh, and then and then, you, and then you look like yeah. that. So Every time they when when douche is it, Jenny. Yeah, when I popped that up, I yeah, I, I love that too. I, and speaking of uh, stuff that I also love, uh, Deucen sent this to us in our group chat from earlier. If you guys haven't done this yet, please click the link down below. Go to James's channel and check out the video that he posted this week. Ah, uh, it, yeah. It 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 it's actually been uh, uh, Deucen who who kind of took note of this in the in the comments of the video. 
Hmm? <laughs> you agree the sentence, sir. What? What? The thing that you the thing that you posted in our group chat, the screenshot of the comments on James' video, this pet like that that came out yesterday. Oh, oh yeah, the, I, the guy the guy who started in the episode, he commented. Yes. And what? what, commented. It, and, and what yes. did he say? Do Come something. on, Tyler. Uh, you gotta keep uh, up, he man. He said, uh, "Okay, this is one of the coolest things I have ever heard for lots for of reasons. Voice. First of all." This was my very first cartoon voice over session. I got my SAG card for this season. Whoa. I was also scared to death. Frank Walker is my was my hero. I guess he no longer is. <laughs> after each take, <laughs> after each take, he would give me a thumb up. I guess he no longer is. <laughs> so, so what 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 happened was too he he put it on his personal facebook page hoping that dan mike bell kathy etc would see it and he said that frank doesn't do social media but this was one of the coolest things ever thank you and then he said that michael bell just emailed me that he watched it and then he also copied frank welker on it so that is awesome. so fucking cool man it got like damn it that that is all the credit you guys deserve for putting those videos together man that is yeah. that is unbelievable that that happened yes. like i and Deuce, you give a little context to that because you know everybody was wondering like how did James get even a hold of these you know voice recording sessions? Oh, well, there was one eBay seller who somehow uh, collected a bunch of these uh, old reels. How exactly? No idea. But he was selling them, and he was also willing to sell just the audio. So even if those tapes have sold, he could also obtain those. It's like he, he obtained like a bunch of the recordings some that's amazing music, some just digital it just there's like over 30 hours of the stuff that's like, wild mostly yeah. from transformers there's few episodes from spider-man there's uh some episodes from the unaired show titled uh, young uh, astronauts that was sheltered mm -hmm. due to the shuttle yeah. challenge disaster and, and I think he's got G.I. Joe on there too, which I'm 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 Yeah, there, there's bit, there's, bit. So, there's auditions for the uh for the movie and a few episodes for Dungeons and Dragons. Wow, wow. god. Wow. Also, I think there's a few for My Little Pony as well. Yeah, I remember him saying My Little Pony was in there in that lot as well. But just I know how Joe gets excited about that. Just how those <laughs> videos are, are put together. Like we're 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 hearing like uh scene to uh, take whatever and then you, you actually get to see, most of the time see the scene and then it, it will highlight uh, the static yeah the, the saw james yeah so james uh, yeah. provide uh, <clears throat> some just so you don't stare at the, at the blank screen yeah so uh, go check that out link is in the description below because that i mean it, it's just to unearth that and to put it out there publicly and for people to be able to consume this and hear the outtakes it's it's Fucking and even the yeah. voice actors themselves, something they thought they'd never hear again or, you yeah. know, after yeah. all these years. Yeah. yeah. And also, yeah, all of it is uncensored. No yes, beats, they are. No yeah. silences, yeah. nothing. You get to yeah. hear Frank Welker cussing, Michael Bell cussing. It's all uncensored. Yeah. yeah. I've got, I've got um, audio of the outtakes from uh, the 90s when, when, when I heard, the, like, the the Thundercat outtakes, like the cursing. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That, it's still on my iPod. <laughs> I listen yeah, to the, those, there's I even listen that. Uh, the there's even that uh, video recording that uh, they shot uh, of the last voice session, where yes. uh, Earl Hammond, uh, the, uh, not uh, what, what was the, what was the name of the actor who voiced Mamra? Earl Hammond, I believe. Yeah. So he like he, he ends one line with like motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. He says, "I want, I to, want see your to see your tits, my dear." <laughs> yeah, and she, she yells out, "No I fucking got way, motherfucker!" Mm -hmm. Oh my god! And I remember really heard that in early like, days of the internet. Fuck yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> uh, what the was, fuck is a semi flame? Yeah, I got all yeah, they, yeah. They're all all just like breaking characters, just like yeah. laughing at what they're talking about. I thought that was like unbelievable that that those were on the internet. Like this is like the the probably like ninety seven, ninety eight. I, I was gonna ask them. if this is kind of like the, some someone the yeah, early it, days of yeah, the internet. Yeah, it was real real yeah. early days, like back when yeah, when I, I think 
I, I got I was in college, so it was probably ninety seven, ninety eight. Yeah. Um, and and like all of us in college were like, Oh my god, do you hear this shit? Okay, and we were we were spreading it today, we were emailing it to everybody we knew. Uh, that was a that was a dark time because that's what I, it was just so cold to know that people still remember He Man, Thundercats, Turtles, Transformers, and GI remember, Joe. The, like this was the time when you could still see that stuff on TV. Like yeah. Thundercats was having a second life on Cartoon Network. Yeah, yeah. of course mm-hmm. we didn't we didn't get Cartoon Network. I just knew it was yeah, caught on, on that channel. Like fuck, and then like we'd heard that Sci Fi Channel was playing Bonic Six and Transformers and the Swamp Thing TV series. And I remember the day we got the sci-fi channel, like it was part of the standard cable package. None of it was on there. Not oh, not wow. a single, n- none of it was was on there. I did see Bionic 6 one time in a, a Nags head. Like they had a very limited cable, but they had the sci-fi channel and Bionic 6 was on. I couldn't fucking believe it. Like I was like, and of course my, my best friend at the time, he had no idea what it was. I'm like, it's yeah. just like you just, you know. Just like me. It just, I mean, just, but it, it was just, it really was a, a, like, and I'm sure all of us at some point, you felt like you're the only person on this planet that still remembers and wants to see more of this stuff. Mm-hmm. And you're like, no one else is going to like this stuff, and everyone's going to make fun of you for it. And, and girls aren't going to want to, you know, have anything to do with you because you're like, still like Bionic 6 and Transformers. And, yeah. And here it is, all these years later, men and women are wearing the t shirts, the buying the toys, the kids are getting into it, so, uh, being forced to by their fathers and take, you know, pictures like they're holding the toys. See, my kid likes it too. Fuck you. <laughs> you know, <laughs> let me ask Ren this: When it comes to those uh, audio files of those outtakes, yeah, do you remember the format that they were in? Because I imagine it wasn't MP3; it either had to be like a wave file or like real. I think it was wave. Yeah, wave. I think it was wave. Had, yeah, no, it had, I, I've got it on my on my computer. Uh, okay. I can send the I can send the ones I have to you probably. <clears throat> um, I, 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 I was just curious what I oh, because, you just, that was cold blooded, man. What that was cold I, I blooded. You, you like you like nah, fuck that. I'm cool. No, that's okay. <laughs> that's, no, that's no, that's okay. how I, that's how I heard it. I was just curious <laughs> about <laughs> about the file no, no. type. No, no, it's okay. Yeah, no, no. I mean, I could probably just look them up on YouTube, Brian. Come on, I'm yeah, yeah, they probably are on YouTube. <laughs> Brian's like, no, I got them on my iPod. I see how it is. <laughs> Poor that's what you, hey, that, that's what you get for being in the chat last night and calling us dorks when Tyler and I are sitting there pouring our hearts out about the heartache what? that we had in the, the, the mid-90s listening to Seals Kiss from a Rose. I'm sorry that we were in fifth grade. We didn't get to fuck the girls we were after, Rand. Yeah. Oh, we're, we're not listen, out here hey. getting arrested and getting fucking phone numbers, all right? Hey, listen to me, man. I was, I was using a kiss from a rose in the car. I was getting the ladies. <laughs> and so why, did, why didn't you chime in with that instead of acting like, man, I'm, I'm so much better than these guys? No, no. I wasn't calling you guys dorks because you were listening to kiss from a rose. It was something else you were talking about at the end. I was like, look at these dorks. Like you guys would. Oh, oh I know what it was because because we were knocking Dan Vogelberg. That that's what it was. <laughs> oh yeah, and who was? <laughs> Rand's like, I take that shit personal. <laughs> and then we and bring Tyler, in the back. What's, what, 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 what's, Tyler, what's, what's that? that story about Kiss Kiss from the Ro- Kiss from Rose? Wasn't that originally gonna be like in the Never Ending Story two soundtrack or some shit? Oh, or I, what's I, this? I don't I, I don't remember hearing that. I, as far really? as I know, I Kiss almost... from Rose was originally written for Batman Forever. Batman. Well, I think about the tower. You know, Green Tower. Just yeah, look that up, Nathan. I'm almost. God, certain I, that I, that... I I read it that and I turned that shit off after about twenty minutes. I I, yeah, I, had no I think it was originally gonna be for that, more. and then they yeah, oh, then I thought oh. they. I'm glad well, they maybe, didn't. Maybe they did. I, I thought it was strictly a song that was originally written for Batman uh, Forever. Ju- just a quick Google search. There's a, a topic on Reddit. Today I learned that Seal's mega hit Kiss from Rose originally debuted in the NeverEnding Story 3 before it was released in oh, 1995 oh, three. for Batman Forever. Oh, three. So it was that in crazy? the movie? Okay, that makes more sense because for a movie that went straight to video and they're like, you know what? We'll, 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 <laughs> yeah. we'll, we'll, just, <laughs> we'll, we'll put a, a music video behind this part yeah. of the big. Me- uh, yeah, uh, I, yeah, okay. That's kind of mind blowing. Yeah, that's weird. Right. And, and, and to think, like, that's what they thought. Like, we'll just attach this uh, unbelievable song to this piece of shit sequel the that went straight movie, to video. Yeah. <laughs> Can you? We would have never heard that song. No. And right, like right. nobody would have ever heard that song and and known how good that song was. Yeah. Exactly, if they didn't exactly. Put it in Batman. Exactly. It would have been gone. In, the soundtrack would have been. I mean, even though I love you two's "Hold Me, Throw Me, Kiss Me, Kill Me," like it, it would have just been, uh, you know, just yeah. very lackluster. Because I, I was more addicted to "Kiss from Rose" than than, than yeah. U two song. I, I I grew. To, I will. I love the U two song now even more. 
but uh, uh but Kiss yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bottle. Yeah, those uh, those two guys last night, man. They were they were going off on some weird dorky tangents, man. They, weird. They were, that's just personal they, stories, they were all, man. They were all kumbaya and on the on the screen. I'm like, look at these. Little well, we people. we have to because we never we never do it on here. We're too busy, uh, you know. Joe's talking about uh, ripping our flopping his bishop all, 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 all over Ren's backside. Yeah. <laughs> You know, it's just well, like, well, we don't, we well, don't have, there's no time for anyone else to talk on here when Joe is like, ah, you like it, Ren? All over your backside there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. And, and Ren just, and Ren just chuckles. <laughs> you <laughs> got me again like, there, Joe. Yes. Oh, man. Well, like, Nathan, Nathan dogging me about, you know, sending him stuff. He's like, nah, I'm, I'm cool, man. It's, not I, dog I it get, is. it's just, I, 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 don't, get, I don't fucking I mean, need it. I can get better downloads than whatever the fuck you can send me. <laughs> yeah, I mean, probably. Oh. You imagine if Rain comes over, like, I, I, I'll fix your sink for you. Like, no, I've actually got to repair it. Oh, I said, fuck you. <laughs> you know, like, if Rain's offered to help you, like, you really don't need his help. He takes it so fucking personal. Like, he's going to go well, in his backyard, dig a hole, and sit in it. That's what he's going to do. Yeah. I'm, and his son's going to have to talk him out. And he's like, Dad, Dad, can you get up? I need you to be my dad for the rest of the day. No, do you mind? no I'm, I'm, I'm going to be shivering in the corner like this motherfucker. Yeah. yeah, like Joe's doing right now, currently in his home. Yeah. <laughs> Look like Jack Nicholson in The Shining in his <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, the around and chasing Jenny. Jenny! <laughs> Joey's oh home. Oh. He, he, he collapses. He falls down in front of his front door and just freezes to death because he's too fucking lazy to go inside. Oh, boy. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I, I, I have and to. they think he's frozen to death. No, he's just fucking white as snow, people. <laughs> You sit out there hibernating. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Jenny. Yeah. <laughs> like hiding in the kitchen. She gets out and, and she's like she's like driving her little trike around Joe's house, trying to keep away from him. <laughs> he comes out of the bathroom naked, laughing like that old lady. Ah! Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> that part it of the shrinkage. Jesus. Jenny shows up at Rebecca and John's house. Like, who did this to you, Jenny? And she looks at Joe. He's like, "You son of a bitch!" And he's just sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake! Joe rewinds oh. that old lady part all the time. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, there's yeah. like, the like, like tracking issues at, oh, on the on the yeah, page. Yeah. Yeah, and he probably kept his away when the old lady comes part. out of the back. Oh god, that scared the shit out of him. And that old lady's like, when she's laughing and. She's all that, fat, that, I mean, shit, moldy. Right, right oh that God, one. that scared the fuck out of me. Man. Now that I can't put on the screen. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. But no. What, I, what I can put on the screen. Oh God, naked what old ladies. Even... Nothing scarier than that, man. You, like <laughs> no. being, being assaulted by a naked old lady who's laughing like a wicked witch at you. Oh. <laughs> I mean, uh, I don't know. I've seen, I've seen scarier things. Oh my god, though. Okay, like, it, it, anything's. Yeah. Oh, oh she's sweat at work. Joe's just like, what a sweet image. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, boy. But what I can put on the screen is this. Here we go. The, All the right, fly... see you later, Ren. <laughs> yeah, get out of here, Ren. <laughs> no, don't, don't need your wave files, and we don't need you here anymore. Have a good night. Son of a bitch. No. We were uh, waiting to hear Rena talk about Grandpa Skeletor. We were looking forward to that shit, but never mind Grandpa Skeletor. Look at that human storky toy. Oh um, yeah, it, it it it's it makes the flying fist look fucking terrible. Oh, that my is God. It, it's so terrible. little. It yeah. looks like it's in the background. It's a toy. It it it, it, it 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 looks like a little like like a little fidget spinner. It's what it looks yeah, like. It makes, hand, a you know? it makes a goofy, goofy, sushi sound. What? I keep thinking, do what so, the fuck is that can, squeaking? Can you tell your bird to shut the fuck up? <laughs> Never. <laughs> Never. <laughs> oh, you want to talk back to me, huh? <laughs> it's not like he did. Like, say so, yeah, kind of. It's like, fuck you, fuck you. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Shit. So, uh, It'd be like that one. Have you guys heard the one where the bird is like screaming for help and the, the cops what? come? Yeah. 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 No, I ain't seen that. Help me. Help me! And then, then somebody called the police, and they come. Yeah, and they, the, they, a they neighbor called jump. police. Yeah. Oh, wow. They shoot the owner. There, no, uh, they do not. There you go, Joe. There's a new. They shot the <laughs> owner. Is that what you said? Yeah. They they didn't. They didn't. Oh, I was gonna say, Joe. Does that sound familiar? 
<laughs> no, no, they, they didn't kill the owner. Joe is still alive. See, see, uh, see. Well, Joe pays the police not to interfere. So, and it, and it wasn't a bird. <laughs> at a Joe's dork. house. <laughs> oh, that's no. a horrible cover. Uh, yeah, so that this, is a terrible. Yeah, cover. it's a shitty cover. This mini comic uh, obviously came with the Flying Fist He Man, but does anyone like what else was it? That's this, it. Uh, just that. It, 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 yeah, yeah, all all, all the variants got a, an exclusive mini comic, like Hurricane Hordak, Terror Claws. They all got. Unfortunately, yeah. Battle Armor, He Man, and Skelter didn't get a, a damn mini comic, Which makes but no. all the other variants did. Go figure. Yeah, I do like and, the beginning of this quite a bit. Uh, just the the opening. Scene. Well, I like the opening shot of like He Man's forces, you know, sitting by a fire and Grayskull kind of talking, but just this. But that's what's weird. They say that they're in the royal palace. That's why I was like, "What the fuck are they oh, talking oh, about?" Oh, yeah, yeah, I, yeah. They, yeah, I forgot about that. Why, why is he even shirtless on the first panel? <laughs> no, it's just shady coloring. Yeah, you can see the outline yeah right there. No, that could be bat muscle, man. Yeah, I mean, look, look at human's dialogue. Scroll down a bit. You don't have to reward me with weapon saucers. Your presence is honor enough. What that the kinda, cock? That, that, uh, kinda, yeah, so, so then she gives him the, the harness and everything right then. Oh, no, not even then. It's just a, a, a an energy source that he just gets. And, like, there's no new armor. She's like, okay, you have this new energy source. And, uh, and then, oh, by the way, here's these weapons. That'll be at your beck and call, like. This does mm. not do any any service to promote and get you excited about like you know fly. I mean this this figure here. Like I know Joe doesn't like it. I fucking love flying no. this He Man, yep. but I love the armor. I think the weapons are cool, and this mini comic doesn't do anything to get this stuff over. Like it's it just, just too it's, forced. It's too forced and just it just doesn't work. This I don't see what, what the harm is. Is just brand new weapons for He Man to use the spinning shield with the, the flying fist weapon, which is just a, a you know a spinning. But then mace. we wouldn't get that amazing part where he calls upon the power. It's like oh my god! But yeah, it's, see, he gets the weapon right so here. Then. It, yeah, it's, oh, it, so dorky. Yeah, well, it's they're drawn so poor. It, it, it's, it's... <laughs> here, He Man, have a new toy. Stop crying. <laughs> and, and they and made the at, shield look so shitty. That's it, the other thing. It, beyond just the yeah, go ahead. It pretty much kind of looks like they were trying to make it look like the original shield, <sighs> even though it, it looks like a radio radioactive sign. Yeah, because you yeah. can't even see you that know? there's functionality to it, like no. how the actual shield is. It's like, damn, this is horribly drawn. And, and uh, which I think it's Bruce Mitchell who drew this piece of shit. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. Skeletor's and, got gummy bear teeth. Yeah, Jim Mitchell. Yeah, Jim. Damn you, Jim Frank. Mitchell. <laughs> uh, and, and look at the shitty Snake Mountain. It's just a fucking mountain. No, you it's know? Mystic Mountains. You funny fan. It's craggy oh, piece. Oh, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Now <laughs> <laughs> well, he got you there. Oh well. God damn. Grandpa Skeletor, uh, well, and then it, we get two bad. I, I'm that not going to no sit and pretend like I've memorized this mini comic backwards and forwards because I have not. So, Deucey, you got me on that one. I will give you all the credit in the world and your badge. Well, 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 let, let, let me jump into this. Do, does this at least garner a little bit uh, a, a positive aspect that we do have two bad? In, in the not story? looking like that. Not, um, not yeah, not looking like that. No, yeah. it's, it's just and they serve no purpose. At least in Battle of Roboto. They're engaged. I don't know. It's it's not that they did a whole lot more in that one either, but I feel like they're portrayed a lot more better than this. And I mean, look, look at does this. Does look like a grandpa. <laughs> you know, yeah, I, don't, just... I don't. I don't know what it is about Jim Mitchell the way he draws villains. He makes him look very old and craggy, like you know, <laughs> like Joe. Like, uh, Joe was like you know eating Tootsie Pops. You know, I never made it without biting. When you did the uh, <laughs> that man at arm shirt, uh, the mandate shirt that you put, do you on want this? Store? Do you want can this you, too? No, this? no. I, I'll wear this on a shirt. Oh god. <laughs> oh, god. See, we can't get oh, Joe wow. to get, uh, get off my lawn. Yeah, get get my lawn. this Skeletor definitely eats some Werther's originals. Please don't yeah. declare and fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my god, it's so terrible. God. But remember, Tyler, you and I, we love everything from the past, remember? You and I, right? <laughs> oh, right? oh, I know. We, we are nothing but angry uh, angry old guys who just stuck in the Blinded past. Uh, no, wait, wait, yeah. hang on. Wait, hang yeah. on. Uh, Tyler, back it up a second. The only the only <laughs> old people we have here presently are Joe and Ren, okay? What the <laughs> hell? Be nice that, 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 that is, that is true. That, 
Ren is old enough to be Joe's grand uh, gr gr son. Grandson. Grandson. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. But like, too bad looks uh, so unthreatening at all. Like he looks very, you right. know, yeah, right here. very like sad and, and just very pathetic. Like almost. I mean, look at that. He's being scolded by Grandpa Skeletor. You won't yeah. look the same. <laughs> He's like, go out, go outside and grab grab a switch off the tree, will you? Back in my day. <laughs> I mean, I just I don't get it. You know, when I'm looking at all the drawings that he's doing of, of everybody, it's like, what were you looking at? How did you come up with that idea? Of too bad. And, it, and, and he's just, done it more than once. Like he did this yeah. in Eye of the Storm. And, um, he did, he didn't draw the fastest draw in the universe either, even though that's fucking shitty too. <laughs> and, and, um, now, uh, and now Prince Adam is going to have a talk with a parrot. Yeah, <laughs> right, like it's everyday thing. Oh, it's, like, it's Deuce's bird. Is that what you got behind you there, Deuce, right here? No, no, my my uh, current parrot is uh, of different breed. Okay. <laughs> but oh. I used to have a, I used to have one like this. Yeah, I, I, this is just such a. Uh, I, I, you know, honestly, I don't, I don't know, because like you know. Mitchell's artwork couldn't save any story, but this is a, not a great story at all. And I, I everything's guy, bad. <laughs> it's just there's nothing salvageable as we as we go along here. So I yeah, we really want to emphasize people, which I, I'm, if anyone who doesn't like us and they keep coming back to watch us, like I, I which I can't imagine that they're they're probably going to watch all those bullshit channels that like to suck the dick of like the Netflix series and all that stuff. But, you know, you ain't gonna find that here, people. It's, it's but, good. We cover like I said everything from good to the. The bad. Wait, 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 wait. wait. And, 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 oh, look, it's Joe and Ren. Yeah, I was gonna what say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Bad. Do that side by side. Yeah. Wait, put the picture over and show the bird. Then show me and Ren. It's the same. Yeah, guy show the, Joe the bird. Get off the other one. one. And when show I grabbed bird. Ren too, like at the convention, yeah, I grabbed yeah. him. Oh, what, Ren's what, hand look at is that. Ren, like that. Ren His hand is the, the same way. Expression. Look at that. That's what I yeah. said. That's what I was saying. It's the same fucking pose. Oh, my God. That's fucking awesome. Huh. What about that? <laughs> I'm the crazy fucking bird. <laughs> Ren's <laughs> Prince Adam. <laughs> Goddamn. Look at Beast Man's mouth. Is it a bird? Like, uh, no, uh, and the, and the, one, and the, uh, the other, right, right right there. Look, look at his mangled mouth there. Like, I just... Oh God! I don't, I don't just, mind that too much, but this is still like, come on! Oh my God! Yeah, oh yeah, skeletal looks fine. Oh, my God! fucking damn Yeah, so it's, I'm assuming they colored it with with watercolor or or moss. Yeah, it, yeah, it, yeah, it looks very. It's very poorly colored. Like everything, and you you think to the <laughs> other guys working on these books, you're like, how is it that the the quality can drop so drastically between the books that come out in one year? And Jesus. Lee Nordling was the editor on all on, on the majority of these mini comics. Like, how do you let this shit go by, man? They they what must have it? had to get this out very very quickly. I, I, guess I don't so. know how good this guy's artwork is on a on a normal basis. But mm. This oh, looks no, very like, very rushed. So you look at the Terror Claws, the scale, the the Terror Claws uh, mini comic that is drawn wonderfully. But I think Bruce Tim did did that one if I remember correctly. Mm -hmm. It's colored okay. beautifully, illustrated so much better. And you, you just look at this, like, like I mean, look at Skeletor, like, I, like I doing think, this, I like, the main like he's got, he's got the, jazz hands. The main <laughs> problem with the coloring was probably that uh, the colors didn't have references, because look at Prince Adam there, it's like, look how bad what? too bad looks stuff behind at, Prince Adam. Look oh at that God. shit. Look at the. Face. At this point. <laughs> they had to have good references, man. Like they, they but, did. That's uh, why Ren, this makes no remember, sense. Yeah, I mean, at least the, the no, figures wait, wait, are wait, there. Wait, wait. If you have nothing else. But remember the UK comics. Those had like a shitload of random references. Oh well, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. But this, this was inexcusable. They should add something like better than this. this uh, yeah, this, this is this is coming, you know, out in our backyard here in the states, and this is right. Just, they knew that skeleton looks amazing right there. Look at it. Oh my god! That, yeah, like, like he got punched in the teeth. That si the side, the image of everybody on his his uh hood. I don't get that. Oh, fuck it. Yeah, look how good yeah. that looks, man. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Put that on uh -huh. a t-shirt. No, no, yeah. No, no. Uh, <laughs> and yeah. do and uh, put a caption back so, in and, my and day. And yet, and yet somehow, Man at Arms and Cyclone and Buzz Off look the least offensive. Like they, yeah. 
You know, like, he's, he's, fucking pale. He's, he's pale. Yeah, he's pale. He's Caucasian. He isn't blue. It's like, what the fuck? I mean, I, and, and and that's, uh, now that's something they've done more than once in the mini comics. Yeah, Why they decided yeah, to make Cyclone, you know, with just and, flesh toned and, skin, you know, just and. And why is Man at Arms drawn per filmation design, but not without mustache? The mustache, yeah. Yeah, it's like yeah. they just looked at the toy, I guess. I, 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 I don't mm. know, there's inconsistencies all over the place. That's so cool, man. And, and Adam could not look more more like Netflix Adam right there, don't you guys think? What <laughs> Netflix that. Adam? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Oh. Weak. Even the fucking oh, radar, that. you know, on Cyclone. Yeah, like, just that like, even kind of looks like the proto- like like one of the concept illustrations of Cyclone, it, like one of the earlier ones. That's what it kind of looks just, like. It looks like every Roboto yeah. or something. Yeah, it does. It, it does yeah, kind of. Have... Maybe this is based on some earlier version. Yeah, mm-hmm. and that's why he's Caucasian. Uh, well, it, well, it makes no sense. Well, hell, even in the Spike Strikes Strikes minicomic, Cyclone is Caucasian in that, even though the figure itself is. Is blue and I, which I know, like the comet was probably went into production. Then they make the changes, so I could forgive at least the logic behind that. But a year later, and you're still making the same mistake. Do you, you know, think, is there any possibility that this could have been a, a concept that was earlier on and is something you know shelved for a while, and then they're like, oh well, let's just go ahead and you know and it could have this up and what, repurpose it. When when James found out that Larry Hughes that the the uh, the shitty Leech mini comic the cover was originally a Larry Hughes illustrated cover and they completely altered it it was supposed to be He Man fighting Skeletor with his battle axe and they just turn it into this mangled poor looking Leech with his staff in his hands and yeah. obviously that was meant for something else so it's very possible Nathan that that, that this story in particular could have been recycled from you know something else so, yeah. so, so, so look at this panel so buzz of tells skeletor that he is going to stink him if something happens to Adam <laughs> now mm-hmm. if uh, when a bee stings you a bee dies he's gonna die well there you go he's gonna sacrifice yeah. he's like uh, I'm going to commit suicide right, if look, you took enough him. shit from Joe last week we're not gonna do it again this week <laughs> Joe, Joe and, and by the way, pop. that's 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 the last you see a buzz off in this fucking mini comic. Yeah. He goes look, do at something look, at that, look at that face. Look at that face. <laughs> he <laughs> looks like a <laughs> he looks like a drunk Brit. And yeah. then Adam Adam just looks like he's he just he's gonna start crying. They they made they made Cyclone a whole bitch in that panel. We're not gonna yeah. fight you, Skeletor. Well, 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 every, everybody, everybody just don't looks hurt like a bitch. Prince. Oh, oh my they god. Thinking? Horrific story. What? Horrible. What? I need to break it. It's just. Oh my god. I'm and then just. He shoots. He shoots Cyclone in the ass. Where's the Rajan Hall? <laughs> On Castle Grayskull. What? Well, what, fuck, what? I what, guess what? Skeletor made it. The I don't know. Oh, right there. Oh, I thought. Yeah. Isn't that the eye? That's supposed to be the eye, isn't it? God, if it is, that's a terrible perspective. Well, yeah, that, that, oh, that's yeah, the eye, is. and there, there's the nose right above there's the jaw. The nose, oh yeah. my yeah. God, it's so low though; it's lower than the nose. Yeah, yeah. Look, at, yeah. look at look yeah. how look how wimpy a cyclone looks there. Yeah. Yeah. It looks like a peanut hey. character. He's like, I don't want to fight. <laughs> I didn't even bother to, to get... myself. Just shadow out the <laughs> rest of him. Just show his neck and head. Like, and then man, I'm just holding his hand out to block a blast from Skeletor. What the fuck? Yeah, that's it. Fuck, I guess it works. Or he's like shut, like, you know, like, ah, you know, like. It's just... look, look at this perspective on the last panel on this page. Yeah, that's the awesome. Tiny oh, cyclone and tiny mad arms. And, 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 the... That is just a Hold shitty on. perspective. Like, he's, he's it's, it, I know it's supposed to be like an imposing, I know what they're going for, but it looks fucking terrible. <laughs> Yeah, also, too. does he cock his hand like a shotgun? A, yeah, like going cock the power into his hand like a shotgun. It Man. does look like that. The, here we go. Here comes the glow. And then they came out of his his fingertips. And this, up this is bullshit, right here. <laughs> like like Adam is just, just he's not touching there, the sword, not and, touching the sword, and, and like the, the guy who wrote this says the wrong words. I am He Man. I am He Man. Oh my God. It's like they should have and I call upon also. the flying fist. Ignore the power sword, which is the source of your power anyway. <laughs> yeah, that one. No, also, look at look at the look at. Is he how squatty he is? He's out of proportion. Oh. 
Skeletor's plan here is to just blast through the door. Like, why yeah. he, didn't he try that before? <laughs> <laughs> Terrible fucking Oh weapons. my god. They just. Ah, Skeletor, I'm going to beat you with my toy. <laughs> I'm going to stick it spinner. up your ass. This is really bad. Oh my god! Like He Man looks look, so look unthreatening look like, like, like that. Like, ah, I'm gonna get you. Ah, it hurts you, prick. <laughs> yes. You can, you can hear the flying fence beat. going wibbity 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 through the air. Oh my god! Yeah. Oh my god! Look at these too guys. bad. I, don't, I too bad. It just continues to look worse and worse throughout this. It just okay. changes in every fucking page, doesn't he? His face. Every page he changes and just looks worse and worse. No consistency to his horrible and, art. It just. And, I, I, and I'm, I'm curious if if Mitchell's like his his mindset is like. I'm drawing this for kids, so I don't want to make it too scary. Maybe. He's the or, 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 thinking, or, or, or kids, make them look you know, imposing. Because the, the heroes have to have villains that look threatening. You know, but you know what's weird, Tyler? What's crazy is when you look at this last, like, zoom in on that too bad face there, the doubles of that. He looks like he finally tried to make him look angry, but it's still horrible. But like in the other pages, his eyes are wide open and white pupils. It's yeah. just, oh my God. It's, it's, there's no direction. No. So be before we go on, real quick, real quick, go back, please. So Skeletor gets hit full fledged in the face with, with this magical, powerful weapon, and it bounces off him, and he goes, "All right, I'm ready to fight." Like it didn't hurt him at all. <laughs> it's like that. It's it's, a, it's, it's almost like it's it was like plastic. just a mild irritation that he's just like, I "I've had enough yeah. of this shit." Stop like, drawing a sponge at, at me. me. <laughs> it's terrible. He hit him with a Nerf weapon. Especially how they try to intro, you know, introduce the story about a big, you know, this powerful, you know, weapon and something yeah. he can call upon. All for that, bang! And look at this: <laughs> the flying fists will prevail, but they're on the floor. He's using the shield. He's so, using the shield, so and, and, that, and it just makes power. them run away like a, a bunch of pussies. Like Skeletor's power, actually screaming. Made Skeletor run because <laughs> it it was reflected <sighs> off of the shield. This story is terrible. He turned bone white at the end too. You see his face? One from yeah. the other yeah. went to bone white. Yeah, like you. <laughs> oh, you fucker! <laughs> <laughs> oh, <A jenny. laughs> oh my god! What a terrible fucking story! Mm. What, what and, a and terrible... It just continues to look more and more puny. Like it's a fucking like you know pixie stick in his yeah. hand. <laughs> Yeah. Also, like, what the hell is that? Man, you know, remember remember those anything. plastic toys they had back in the nineties with like the two the two plastic balls that you would spin and they would smack yeah. each other back and forth. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. That, that's what the flying fist looks like in this book. Or like it's uh, like, that, it's uh, like he swings it around. It's like the plastic balls just smack each other. You just make it. It's like a noise maker, <laughs> yeah. you know. Or like that uh, toy that uh, is has that propeller that's pushed by the wind. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It, it, also, yeah, like, the, like like a little kid's propeller. Like you yeah. hold up in the air. Yeah. 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 It's, Man, it's Tom's, uh, Man Tom's apparently doesn't know him and his Adam. <laughs> yeah, I've uh, yeah, seen that. Yeah. E either, that or, either that or he's just playing stupid because Cyclones. I know. think they just yeah. don't know what they're writing for this one. This well, one, I, I actually would think probably more towards that. Yeah, Logic yeah. went out the door with this story. It's yeah. Just... Yeah. You know what's weird is looking at his weapon there though. It almost looks like they were drawn like from Hurricane Hordak. Remember the the Bolo one that had yes, the three parts? Yeah. On? yeah. Yeah. Oh, this was just a shit tastic mini comic. I I'm curious also, what people also, in the chat if they liked it. Also, look at look at the last panel. Man at Arms doesn't have any underwear. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, of course, Deuce's gonna. <laughs> yeah, Deuce's yeah. always looking at man's man. legs all the time. <laughs> Because <laughs> he says about Skeletor, remember Skeletor, look at his butt. Get his <laughs> butt out. Yeah, wow. in the initial mini comics, uh, Skeletor has no underwear whatsoever. He's literally butt naked. <laughs> Woo. That was uh, just. All right, all right. well, how, uh, much like we do out when we. Uh, how to make it better? Well, uh, well, not only that, but, but before we do that, out of out of ten, what would you give this? this I thing? give this. No, I I hate this thing. It doesn't even get nothing from me. They, they don't even, their intent. We could say, oh, there's intent there. They could have had a good story, but they didn't. Nothing fucking worked. I, if we can give a zero, I'd give zero, but I'd say one out of ten. It's just terrible. Yeah, because yeah, the actual thing is really big here. Yeah, the right? the flying fist, like yeah. the, the 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 shield and the weapon itself, looks yeah. very. 
Yeah. Like well, they, they serve a purpose. Like you can see He Man like bl- blasting back and reflecting stuff, and then just smacking the shit out of multiple people with the And picture mace. if he would have had that armor on in this issue too. Something you know. That, that's another thing too. Like so give a a you know like He Man's armor like the the battle harness gets damaged in battle, and the sorcerer prepares like this. You know, I you could even if it's a very simple logic of like trying to get the figure or the character to to be depicted this way. You could work it in there. It could be done very simply, but it, it'd be a lot of fun to put together, like logic Nathan. behind, like the the flying Nathan. fist. Like it's not a magical weapon. It it doesn't need to be. It's just Nathan. another another. Okay, do some. Yeah, uh, scroll up, scroll up. Zooming on that's too bad. Is that is that better? Is that better than the mini comic? Yes, that's better than yeah. the mini comic. I look at him. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's not great, but it's yeah, better. It's better. And look at that spiker. A spiker looks puffy. Ah. He looks like um. He looks like an origins. Uh, he looks yeah. like constantly yeah, like shit, like shit, yeah. like an origins figure. But who's it's he, it's who's he look like, Ren? Monstar. He looks like Monstar. Oh no, he doesn't. He he looks like Monstar in that picture. He does. I see what you're saying, but not really. I see what he's saying, but I'm like, yeah, I'm with Joe. I'm like, I, 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 I know what he's going with it, but he does. Does. I don't want to in- insult Monstar because that's not Spike or his finest. But, <laughs> right. but th- th- this figure lacks so much, you know, uh, fanfare. I-, I think most people just d- disregard the Flying Fist figure, and I don't know why. But I love the armor. I think the armor looks great. The, sh- the shield looks fucking amazing, and the, the spinning he's mace got weapon. two belts on. His neck and looks he does weird. have a double belt. Yeah. It looks his awesome. Looks it's weird. a nice color break, though. I, I think it looks good, though. But what's, what's with his neck? Look at that. So yeah, I, I've, no, I've noticed that, and they're all like that. I, I, know, I, I think the figure overall, look, it, it doesn't blend well. Like, the head, head sculpt doesn't blend with the, the, the skin tone of the body, though. Yeah. A little, little, uh, little Amato right here between, like, his face. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Very pale. And, yeah. And also, remember... This is the figure that has the giant, if I'm not mistaken, right foot. Yeah, I if can you look, see the, the foot. Yeah, if you look big. at the bottom, remember I showed a comparison on uh, Facebook one yeah, time. I yeah, put, yeah. yeah, go ahead, and, go ahead and show that to them. Yeah, the camera, yeah it yeah. is gigantic. It's, you yeah, especially see, you put, it, the, yeah, it is. There is a difference there. <laughs> yeah, definitely right. wider. Was, wow. was this supposed yeah. to be originally Bigfoot Human? Oh, okay. what was it? Um, uh, what do they call the one that had that kicking feature, that concept figure? I fucking forgot what was they it called foot? There, what, was it. Was it Bigfoot? Or something? Was ah, it shit. Bigfoot? And the, <laughs> ah. Everybody take a shot. And well, then Hanson, I've got, wasn't I've Hanson got to go. the one with the big... Oh. Ren, All right, Ren, it's good having guys. you. Ren, we'll yeah, see you gotta, later, boy. Go. Take care, right. lady. I'm glad we got through the uh, mini comic, and uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, it was Yeah, I'm glad you enjoyed it. terrible. Be safe, Ren. Thanks, guys. Take it See easy. You, bye. Right. See ya. Bye. Bye. All right. Uh, well, we're all in agreement that that mini comic sucks, and it's it's not the worst. Yeah. That would that would still go to like the leech, the Montana one, and the co- and the cosmic key. Like th- those are, oh. but that 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 would be next in line. I, I think it's it's got stuff in it that uh, you could like the beginning how it starts. You, you could you could kind of go with that and then change around it. What would we do differently here? I, I really would just make it like an, a new a new weapon for him and use like nothing enchanted about it because I feel like the power sword like you got the ultimate of ultimate weapons there. This is just you know yeah we're trying to sell a new a new variant but make it worthwhile make it like when you buy this figure that this weapon is is a wonderful alternative. Like if Skeletor were to capture the power sword, you know for whatever reason you know this this new weapon here will will help you know help you you know protect you from you know. Whatever skill, I, I just feel like you could you could make it a very threatening weapon for him to use. That if he doesn't have the power sword, he's got the flying fist and the spinning shield. Yeah, and even you know, a possible armor, you know, like you know, for situations to where, as we've seen in early comics, to where his, you know, his power harness could have been taken off or taken away, but this one with being enchanted and covering the whole body is an armor that he wouldn't have to worry about being taken off or stolen or you know to be used for somebody else if it's an armor that could amplify but, but that just strength. raises a question joe why why isn't the, the harness then enchanted no, no no true but you know it's just i'm saying because we've seen it in the early comics they just easily took it off you know eh, i got it and remember we yeah, all but those, those comics well, well like if they were if, if they were going to like going forward 
Yeah, because like like uh, like in the uh, the Star Comics, they were going to incorporate the movie look, and going forward, like if if He Man's look was going to be like this new like kind of you know vac metal armor going forward, like because the the power harness in in the mini comics is never really explained about like and at least in Evil Lynn's plot that the harness has, has got cordite in it to kind of enhance its power. It's just it's it's a passing statement, but it's something that you know I, I know it stuck with Joe. I've always thought about that. I'm sure Deuce and James have thought that too. Maybe not James because he, he likes to shit on She Demon and Phantom, so he didn't know shit. <laughs> right. um, but I, I just feel like you could justify that, okay, we're going to retire this look and just say it was damaged in battle and that, you know, the power source is, is, is it's, it's, it's just kind of there as his armor. So, to, you know, bring in this new. I mean, you could have done that with the battle armor. That he oh, sure. power I mean. got, got yeah. destroyed and then the battle armor stand, and the skeleton is so impressed by this. Like watching from afar, like, well, if he has got new armor, I need to have something myself. Yeah, if that's the I way, wanna... like, just selling the figures, and you're right, and they yeah. want to introduce into the story that actually makes sense. Because you're right, first, like, with the early mini comics, he had the force field armor and then the power harness. So, like, they both looked exactly the same, except one could protect them, you know, better, and one would add to his strength. And then, of course, then in the cartoon, we, the Cordite, we find out it amplifies his powers by 100, if I'm not mistaken. But, no, you're right. Just if that's their way of doing it into the mini comics, into other stories, and you could see that they were really going forward at one point with the battle armor, all sorts yeah. of merchandise it was, it was, Yeah, that was probably used more than any of the other variants was the oh, battle. Yeah. And it looked good. I, I was... That's why I, I so wanted the He-Man Battle Armor figure, and I never had his kid, but it, it was depicted so much in T-shirts and various other designs. And Thunder Punch was used, nice. you know, Thunder Punch was used, and that's why I, I really wish I would have loved to see more of the Flying Fist uh, outfit used. As like, all right, this year, this is the look we're going for He-Man. Like anytime you see He-Man on a lunchbox, PJs, folders, school supplies, it's, you're gonna see the Flying Fist look. Even if he's got the Power Sword, this new look because it just looks good. Yeah. I love, yeah. I love the HM emblem i just always thought that was such a, a oh, yeah. an original idea it felt like you know? it was yeah it was like his it stood out it was iconic yeah. like when you talk about the thunder punch like there's a couple things i know like with some of the pj pajamas um there was the thunder punch and then on the one i, I, which I, I had i have that a, a picture right there of of uh, he man when the thunder punch was cycling I, that, I was so proud of that pajama set oh my god yeah yeah those those and and on the lunch box so the yep. thunder punch it, it got some it got some uh you know things that it was used on but yeah flying fists there's a couple things i'm gonna have to look well hell when we do the merchandise episode i'll make sure i have things ready but a be sure that you do, Joe. I don't want you to show up next week and say, "Well, I got sidetracked. I was going to go to the post office, and I forgot <laughs> to do that too." Yeah, he, that, we're giving him too much. That, that's yeah, the problem. And Joe's it's overwhelmed. Like, He's going to go. We're telling uh, him to watch uh, a certain thing, or like, "Hey, Joe, you got like eighty of those those books that you need to, to mail out." And when we're doing that, <laughs> it's taking him away from something else. But yes, a little spoiler for next week. Next week, we are going to be talking about uh, said merchandise, all the random stuff, pajamas, the the toothbrush sets. Uh, God. There's just so Lunchbox. much clothing, shit. like clothing, raincoats, you name it. Like that was a cool thing about PowerCon is that it would see some of the vintage raincoats. The guy, of course, every, all the vendors wanted, you know, they, your heart I, and soul. I, I, I didn't see prices on those. On the, the and I wasn't you know, bother, want I, knowing how much. I mean, every vendor was asking, you know, for your home. Your first you born, ain't shit. You, you know, weren't gonna get shit it, cheap. No way. Yeah, uh -uh. It was, and I'm sure all that stuff went back with them too. You know, like I would have loved to have bought the He Man raincoat they had because I had that when I was a kid. I would and love is that the yellow it. one with He Man and Triclops? Is that the one that was there? Was it this one oh, green? No, 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 actually, I think they had a blue one with He Man fighting uh, Triclops, and yeah. then the yellow one, which was He Man on back. That's the one I had as a kid. Uh, okay, and they did well, have that they, one. All right, because they did switch it up. Like uh, a lot of those raincoats. They would have, you know, like the yellow one would have maybe one image of the one with He-Man, then could have He-Man Triclops. Like they reused it just to recycle, basically get on different colors of the green one, blue yeah, one, red, Yeah, because when I, when, I, when I saw it as a kid, there was a kid wearing the, uh, the He-Man Triclops raincoat, but it was a yellow raincoat. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah I'll never forget it because I was in the backseat of, of my babysitter's car dropping me off of school. Oh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> Isn't that you something? Know? That was a I, I, bitch just, to redraw too. Remember when I found oh, that I Google know. image? I, and I, I, I'm so thankful you did it. Then I, I, it's you know I remember Kevin Sharp loved it so much he went and redid his own version of it. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pretty but cool. that, that's something I you know why you know of course we we all know how Mattel does things, but just knowing that there's all that amazing artwork that was used on T-shirts and and attire for us as when we were kids. Why can't you put that on 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 adult clothing now and not color it bleached all the fucking time? 
Anytime you see filmation, he man, and, and do I, I credit Deucen for this, is it always looks bleached. That you never see He Man with the tan. Everyone looks pasty pale. I mean, every character the the, the colors are off model. They don't look right. And it's, every time <clears> you see a shitty He Man T shirt, it's it's this shitty coloring. It's just why can't we have some of those awesome er Errol McCarthy designs I on T shirts? I, 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 I think they were pale because it, it was inspiration for. Um, middle-aged men like joe to be like hey there's there's people out there that look just like just, just like me i can relate you know god god bless you mattel <laughs> but no uh, but, yeah to, but, to, have but, all, to have all those those things and to not just repurpose them and and put that out there again why not yeah, i mean they, they've done it with you know vintage comic book artwork they've done it with vintage star wars artwork transformers They'll put the box art of Transformers like on T-shirts. They've done it for years. Mm -hmm. Why he meant is just going to pick the laziest, you know, illustration of filmation and just slap over it on there and the over, over, over and over and over, over again. I fuck it, Cracker Barrel. I saw a he man T-shirt with the shitty filmation design with the colors all fucked up and everything. Really? At Cracker yeah. Barrel? Yeah. Fucking Christ. Cracker Barrel. <laughs> you know, I'm like motherfucker. Like I wouldn't have bought it anyway, but it's just like the, it's everywhere, and that's why I'm like I have. I got to resort to hoping Joe will do a t-shirt design or get something from Ren because we cannot rely on the people who are in charge oh. of this stuff to actually put out quality shit. Funny you, you actually uh, mentioned that. Link down below. He posted on our group and he posted on on his personal page here. Let me go ahead and um, get this. What's Ren got a new shirt? <laughs> I, I'm glad what? you're in the loop, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> here, Here is Ren's newest design. Actually, can I... Might see. Let's do. They won't ah. let you. They won't let you save. I think on T Public, they got a yeah. weird feature. You can't save their photos. I'll, I'll, I'll zoom in. Try uh, dragging the picture to the other address bar. Eh, I'll just zoom in on it. It's fine. Yeah, th this this is yeah, what we have great. to do to make sure make sure that uh, there's quality He Man attire out there for people to purchase. But at, get it quickly. <laughs> yeah. all, all I can say, I went and got mine on a t-shirt and a tank top because I'm like, I, I want to make sure I've got options for this in case uh, someone decides, oh, wait, that's too fucking good. Take it away. <laughs> yeah, because you know what's funny, Tyler? It's, it's the shirt that you and I hate the most. There's the one He-Man group by Admin. And we could tell when there's like people there that are spamming with stuff. And the one guy said, look at the shirt I got. And he wanted to prove and I denied. It was that. Somebody call the vet. These puppies are sick. And it was that filmation He-Man. Oh I'm like, God. oh, for fuck's sake. How do people find that entertaining? Like, that's that's really cool, huh? I just don't get it. And, and someone who bought that from, from 80stees.com, like, they have, like, all these cool designs, but they want 50 bucks for a T-shirt. But then they have all these shitty He-Man and She-Ra designs, like, all over the shirts. Yeah, and they're just fucking idiots. And they're, and they're oh, this is so funny. Uh, the, the Christmas part is that way. Like, the shitty pose of He-Man flexing, like... Hey. Oh my God! Just stop! Oh, yeah. Stop! Hell yeah! Uh, going going back to the the variants and Tyler, you're talking about uh, battle armor. Battle armor He Man is my absolute favorite. Variant. Oh, it's awesome! It's awesome. It, it, yeah. To me, it's my favorite look of He Man. I think period. Even even compared even to the original. original. Well, I mean, yeah. I, I I can't argue that it's it's what 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 is everyone's like? Deuce and Joe. Like what what is your if, even if just variant, like Nathan's, like that's his defender. But what what do you guys feel like is the best variant of the you know that that has come out? Uh, well, for me, uh, and I, I love the battle armors. I both of them. I used to just play with them obsessively. I just love that fucking gimmick. There was something, even though I, I know it looks big to some people, but I just love Thunder Punch because I love that gimmick and the pop and the smack yeah. and the smell and everything. So <laughs> for me, I used to, I did. It was just so fucking no, cool. No, I, I was gonna say videos on the channel of you playing with oh, that one and <laughs> the one that the house did, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, for me, I, I guess with the He Man's, when it comes to variants, I love Thunder Punch, Battle Armor, then Flying Fists, and when it comes to the Skeletors. I just really fucking love Terra Claw Skeletor, and then I like Battle Armor, and then Dragon Blaster. Yeah, I, love, I like Battle Armor Skeletor quite a bit. Yeah, he he looks yeah. pretty 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 damn badass. I think it's probably the best looking variant, just because, because he, it's uh, how not he's the depicted. Same for people are wondering, remember those are different battle armors for He Man and Skeletor. There are actual differences. Well, and, just and, I love how Skeletor's is depicted with that the 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 border and like the black trim around his outfit. There, it's mm -hmm. it's. And then the, the that logo, the yeah. the bat with the green, the purple, yeah, like it, it just is, looks so it, the, so. The colors unique. just work very yeah, well. Yeah, it it's, it's a beautiful design. It's it's unbelievable. Yeah. 
You know, but honestly, I don't think really there was a bad variant in the vintage line. I mean, Hurricane Hordak and Buzzsaw were very weak, you know, yeah. but they were not like, oh my god, this this is like this is like fucking, you know, two thousand X variant bullshit. Right. You know, they were. What about you, know, they were... <laughs> Laser <laughs> He Man looked totally interesting. So. Oh, okay, Laser Power He Man. Yeah. Uh, I, 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 it's, easy, it's easy to forget this, but both of those look good too. Both those variants were, you know, I, I like both of those myself. Skeletor looks creepier and fuck yeah. with his face. I mean, yeah, my I god. Think, yeah. And I, I did like the, the light up feature. That. Yeah, he was he was I, creepier and shit. I, now with uh, laser power, uh, He Man, are you Tyler? For you with that figure, were you, were you kind of using that as like your your live action? Version? Oh, I never had it. I never okay. had it. I remember those yeah, were yeah, fucking we, yeah, European we, exclusives. Yeah. We didn't get that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Yeah, I had no idea. And until, they uh, made two versions. Right? Yeah, uh, we got the Dolphin okay. and yeah. the Heat. The, yeah. the yeah. classic. Yeah. Yep, but I, I but I did like the the the, uh, the newer He Man sculpt, like the head sculpt. I thought it was a very unique. Like this is just you know, I don't. I just thought it worked worked fine for that character. Like Skeletor looks yeah, drastically stood different. Out. Did you end up getting that figure at all? No, no, neither one of them. Even in the early days of eBay. They were expensive because all I had was, you know, my, my lawn loan money and what allowance I would get. So it was, you know, so I, I did get a pair of Basically, cost. what you're trying to say is your collection isn't complete. And you're not. No, it is not complete. It, it will never be complete. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I, but I, I'm just getting higher yeah, and higher. It's I, really I just, I, 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 The people on eBay, they're just a bunch of fucking Nazis, man. Like, it's just, you know, I know everyone wants to make money and th this stuff. Is it's big business right now, and it'll, it'll never die down. Like I'm glad yeah. to know there is still a demand for the vintage line, and people want to pay good money for it. But some of the stuffs just like, j just for fun, when you go and just like look up, you know, some of the some of the the, the various interesting artifacts that are so hard to find, and you just you find one, and the guy's asking damn near half a million dollars just because he thinks it's justified. Well, uh, what the, you know? the crazy thing too is, uh, and Joe can attest to this. Is even though the attorney in place set here was a crowdfunded thing and you had time to do it, they're being yeah. listed, of course, on eBay out the ass, and people are buying them. I'm like, why didn't you just contribute to I, the, the I know I thought the same thing, and I know that some people said, well, maybe you know, we were thinking yeah, maybe they but now have you're the money. You're spending like two to three times more. Do you know how much one now. of them paid on for just shipping? I seen in a group. Uh, one of my friends was selling to somebody. I think it was, how was it in Spain? I think ugh. the person paid five hundred dollars for just shipping. Oh my God, $500. and that's not including the import taxes, right? The oh import customs. You're better tax. off buying a fucking uh, event, uh, an original attorney a play set, you know, for like over a thousand dollars. You know? could, and then look what they're selling: King Graceful or King Grayskull and the Moat Monster for those are selling super. I'm high. sorry, but but if you're willing to pay a ridiculous price for a fucking King Grayskull figure, man, who the hell are you, man? Like I, I just. <laughs> You, are you a human tree stump with the brain of an ice cube? Like, I, I just, I can't. Worst part is that they're going, they're going to buy the figure only to resell it. Oh, pretty I'm sure. much. Yeah, you know, and jack it up and 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 charge twice what they paid yeah. for. Thinking like, oh man, yeah, and, ah, and, ah. and that way it just keeps growing in price, mm -hmm. and it's like. You're going to just hit a dead end when nobody. Oh yeah! Buys it. Eventually, someone's going to get stuck with it and not be able to to move mm -hmm. it. Just like a bunch mm -hmm. of uh, Netflix Shira merchandise, nothing. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, we get yeah. clear out at Target all the time. Yeah, shit. Right. And I tell you, if somebody in the future would offer me some good money, which I bet they would for the box, I'm not saying this sound nuts, but I have the best looking Eternia box that I've seen posted anywhere, anywhere on social media so far. Everybody so who's gotten their thing, get rid of it. What's well, that? even even if they were to, like had gave were willing to offer like a lot of money, Joe wouldn't get it to because he wouldn't make it to the post office. <laughs> you know, <laughs> See, but the, the, the guy was shipping though. the money, but you know, Joe would be like, oh, I guess it just got lost in the mail, <laughs> buddy. I don't know what to say. But here's the weird thing: is a lot of people had the outer shipping box look really good, and then they opened up and their their box was crushed. Or just they got holes in them. It's still haven't Nathan, opened it. Yeah. God damn it, Nathan. Why don't you <laughs> just right open back. it, see if it's good? What's yeah, open it. Tonight. It's now. It's now uh, live on air. Do it. Yeah, oh, just come God. on, man. Come on, come on. Good Let's go. see this. Well, how about uh, I'll wait when Tyler comes back. 
You know he don't care about that. See, how about you get it prepared while he's pissing? Just go over there, get it close, get a good light on. We'll see what this looks like. Yeah, but like I'll probably remove myself from the stream and then get up. So it's just uh, Tyler and Deuce in here, and I'll go. Wait, uh, you're uh, not wearing anything down there? Yeah, that's right. I'm pulling a motto tonight, not wearing any pants. So. I mean, I know Deuce and that that appeals to you, and you're super into like when, when things are wearing underwear. I know you're one to point it out all the time, but yeah, I'm yeah, I'm because hoping it's just that's in- a detail that uh, people keeps uh, missing, uh, skipping uh, with, when they talk about uh, the initial mini comics. They all talk about how savage it was, but they're not. They're, none of them is, are mentioning is, how butt is, naked skeletons. Is nudity <laughs> not savage enough for you, Deuce? But that's the thing. They're not saying it's that savage. They're saying, oh, it's violent. Well, no, a rocket rock skeleton's butt. Right. Yeah, I still am amused how that everybody thinks that is violent. Like, where's the violence? Where's this blood? Where's the savagery in it? It's like it doesn't exist. But All right. All right well, but, go ahead. You well, yeah, yeah. Now, and now that Tyler's back, let me do the echo cancellation thing on him. I'll remove myself from the stream, go unbox that, change the lighting in here, and then we can – I'll – I'll we I'll report and let everyone know if 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 it's as busted as some of the other ones. All right, I'll be back. Just oh, yeah. drag it to, toward your computer and open it. No. Yeah, just turn it towards yes. the. Oh, that. No, <laughs> yeah, I, I can't can. believe that he's butt naked. What a pervert! <laughs> God damn. No, but uh, well, Tyler, shit. Has there been while well, Nathan's doing that? Any new stuff that's came out or is coming out that you were getting from anything or pre-ordered Silverhawk stuff? What I didn't know what kind of new stuff was coming out that you were getting recently. Just just Copper Kid, G.I. Joe Classifies, the Thundercats that have all been um, up for pre-order, uh, other than Queen Willa. Um, I'm, I'm aiming to get all of those. you know. But thankfully, everything's been pushed back, as you can rely on Super 7, like nothing arrives on time. So okay. it, it's just, you know, I, I, don't, I don't have it. It's nice to kind of just take a break. I bought a bunch of classified figures like last month and i'm like i just checked out for a while now so i'm i'm pretty much just pre-orders that are supposed to arrive later this year like in april and something like that it's all silverhawks thundercast gi joe that is it there's, there's nothing and, else I, I don't think i have pre-ordered as for the joe. silverhawks oh wait hold wait, one quick thing for the silverhawks are those any of them chromed or no. did they no well, no, no 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 they did they did announce steel, steel heart and quicksilver would be you know, re-released with vac metal on them um, okay, but I, I've yet to pre-order those. I, I just, you know, I mean, they look good, but you're essentially paying another sixty bucks to get oh. those. And, and I'm like, ah, uh, you know what? The one you got me is fine. Um, okay, and I, I'm happy with the the Quicksilver that I've got, which I, he's over there. I hadn't put him on the shelf yet. Still, just okay. uh, it, it's I, all my shelves are tapped out. I'm like, I, I either have got to do a br- <laughs> yeah. I've got to do a brand new setup or do a big rearrange. And I really so want to have Thundercats. Yeah, yeah, and I'm like, I, I'd rather have all three toy lines depicted together, in, you know, together because I just like seeing He Man and, so- and Thundercats together, and I definitely want to see Thundercats and Silver Hawks together. So, yeah, kind of hard to make it all work here. All right, and Dusha, what were you saying? Uh, can, have you been in any stores recently, like comic book shops, for example? Oh, I'm gonna this coming week because I need new paints. I'll go to the comic shop and I'll check to see how some comics are selling just to see. I'll take a look. Oh, what piece of shit comic are you guys like wanting to figure you know, out? I think Dushin is Transformers, curious. GI Joe, Thundercats, stuff like that. Oh, He's oh, cute. like the, the, the you know, well, like, because I know, well, GI Joe and Transformers are just so ongoing, but I, I know there's like, a, they started Thund- the, the new, the new lines because uh, the publisher has uh, switched. Also, all, all three got, got, uh, are getting rebooted then. Yeah, like uh, okay. the, you have Thundercats uh, at uh, Dynamite Comics, and you yeah, have, and I uh, saw the updates for the characters. And... Transformers and Jojo are at uh, Skybound slash Image uh, Comics. Okay, God, yeah, right. so yeah, yeah, Joe was with Image back in the day. I'll keep an eye out. I'll see how they're selling because he's curious, you know, with. Just the sales on it. But I want to, um, there's one figure I was going to say I did pre order and it was supposed to come out, I think, in December, then January, and now February, and it keeps getting pushed. It's Frank Dukes. Did you pre order that figure of Van Damme? Because it looks I, cool as shit. I, I don't know. I, I, I did it first because I was like, mm-hmm. I, I just, I, I want to have some, some Van Damme representation. I, I kept looking at him like, 
I wasn't too keen on the sculpt. I thought it was, uh, you know, and they were doing one of, of, of him from Kickboxer also. And I, I they? just feel like I didn't the, know that. the, yeah, um, I just felt <clears> like the face sculpts were a bit flat. You know, I, I know they had the it, one that was a real expressive face. I was like, maybe it would look better in person, but I had to get it because, like, like you said, I've never had a figure of them. And I was like, oh, shit, what the hell? Maybe it'll look a lot better when I get them in hand. I mean, I, I really wish that, that Van Damme would have a, a line that would feature, like, a lot of his, fa you know, his most famous characters and, and a line of some kind, like, you know, Frank Dukes and, you know, from Kickboxer and, and uh, Leon from Lionheart and, and Luke ah, Devereaux yeah. from Universal Soldier. Like, I just, I, and I, I would buy and support that line, but I just, um, I, yeah, I just, I, I canceled my pre order. I was just like, I don't. I just feel like this is not looking as good as I would have preferred. I mean, I, I have an original Bloodsport poster on display. I got an original Kickboxer poster on display. So I do have some some legit Van Damme representation, but I, I just like I, I need a little bit more quality in those. And and I haven't seen the review if they're if they're in hand at all now or anything like that. Because I was thinking the 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 Frank Dukes when had come out, I thought. Um or maybe no, it was pushed back. I, mean, I still haven't I still haven't got it. It just keeps okay. every time it says, Oh, shipping, shipping, shipping. And then it, it, it just keeps getting pushed constantly. It's like, why have I not got this yet? Uh, I guess it's just being delayed for maybe it's because they're realizing the face sculpt just not as good as it should be. Yeah. Honestly. Because I see what they were trying, but just, Oh, oh shit. Okay. Got to zoom in on you. Oh, no, 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 no. I was just going to uh, attack onto that. Uh, in agreement with Tyler, when it was announced, I think I had pre-ordered one of them and then, over time, I said, I, I was like, nah, this doesn't look as great. Yeah. Uh, so I went ahead and canceled mine as well. But uh, happy to report that it's. You got a perfect one. All sides. Yeah. Good. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Well, damn, you're one of the rare ones too. I should you know. Yeah. Everybody's, that has to be at least a good feeling because everybody's got fucktastic boxes. And for people that like mint and box stuff, well, they're screwed. Because Mattel yeah. ain't going to get them any replacement box. They basically oh, yeah. are saying, oh, uh, if you could just send back the, th you know, the entire set for your money and get a refund, but you're not getting any replacement. Like, Jesus Christ. Yeah, the, the biggest problem I'm going to have is, like, where the fuck am I going to put that? Am I going to unbox <laughs> it and display it somewhere? I think I, I'm just going to have to basement? take the yeah, I, basement probably and just set up a, a vintage display. That's, okay. That's, that's the only way. Because it's not gonna fucking fit up here, that's for sure. Whew, no way. That because it is it's giant. But yeah. I'm glad it's I'm glad it arrived yeah. safe and and perfect. Hopefully, like, it, absolutely yeah. perfect. Good. And and again, hopefully all the contents that are in there because my baby Jen was telling me about people online <laughs> posting. They said they opened up their attorney and they were missing shit inside Great. the box. Great. Oh, sure. you better check right now. No, I'm not no, 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 right no, no, no. There's too much shit. No, he would be there all day. But, uh, well, hell, if you want, we can see if there's any questions from the chat. Yeah. You guys got any questions, pop them up here, and we'll answer whatever the hell you want. But no, I'm, gl I'm glad that was safe for you. Yeah. Poster now, is a cool bonus. Unless something is missing. Now, granted, <laughs> I when I... I check right now, but that's just me. <laughs> no, when, no. When I did take it out of the box and I was, like, shifting it around, I heard some pieces in there just like... Gong, gong, gong. Was it, oh, no, no, normal? no, don't worry. That, yeah, that's probably okay. just the track pieces. The track okay. pieces... Oh, did we lose Joe? Even when he doesn't have video, we lose him. Yeah. <laughs> Hello? He froze. Joe Amato, are he you He literally there? froze. It's that cold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, let's check in live with Joe Amato. Uh, Joe, are you there? Jerry. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, there we go. Now, now you're back. Ah, oh, then he, he left. Stopped out. All you hear is, God damn it. And then you just... <laughs> It disappears again. Yeah. I think one of the victims got out of the oven. No. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he dropped the tablet into the toilet. I I'm just assuming that Joe doesn't pay his uh, his heat bill. Or much but of anything. He just relies on like sad stories like, you know, all right, all right, son, we'll, we'll, we'll let you go another month without paying your, your, <laughs> your light bill, your heating bill, your trash, your water. Yeah. You know, he just relies on telling sob stories all the time. He's he's a man of a thousand excuses. Uh, he's going has... to pull this uh, when we watch Bucky. Just wait, in, just wait and see. Oh, we know we we're, we're expecting him to be a Joe, missing in action. Okay, can you hear me now? Yes, yeah, we can but hear you now. 
Yeah, because it was weird. You were like, oh, I can't hear. I was like, God damn it. And then right when I was getting ready, I started to hang up and heard you say, wait. But I already touched yeah, it. You, so. you, yeah, you already touched it. You know, Joe, if you just turn the heat on, it won't be so cold in your house. Hey, yeah, yeah. God damn. Or pay uh, your bill. Put on that jacket. <laughs> <laughs> the Febmon and asked if I could do a video review and assembly video. I'm going to rely on uh, on Joe because he, he's got videos that he's taken of the set. I'll let Joe do it. since his But his camera can... froze. Yeah, but uh, he, he he can record it and do do it live in the thing, and then I can just just leech yeah. off of that and just put it on the channel. It's way easier for me to do that. I can do that. I could just send you a couple of things that I did. Oh did wait, sorry. Between picture? between that and taking pictures of your collection for the stuff for next week, we're and asking too much. Of the we're asking too much. A hot dogs, Joe. Hot dogs. <laughs> oh wait, what? What hot dogs? No, <laughs> you got my attention. Oh, Joe, does he, Joe does his review, and you can see his breath. All the time. <laughs> Could you yeah. imagine that? Yeah. That'd be fucking I'm terrible. I'm just gonna take his videos and then just tack this on at the end of it. Yeah. <laughs> or or this. Yeah. <laughs> any oh, of the shit. any of the things that that we have there. And I thought I sent pictures. I didn't send you any pictures or videos, Nathan, or nothing. Uh, of uh, the attorney place up. Yeah. I mean, you I sent did. me the the uh, stuff of attorney a little bit. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was like, yeah, I thought I, it showed I, a comparison of size and a little bit of well. Okay. Okay. Yeah. But, yeah. I'll, yeah. You, you could see the the bodies in the in the ah. very edge of the video. And all right. Well, if you suckers I'm, I'm remember, you got some questions. Hit us with some questions right now before we wrap it up. Get some good ones in here. Anything you want. There's. God damn it. There is one from Philippe, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna give Deuce on that that luxury. No. Uh, because I think uh, Dushin would like uh, Rage Out. Yeah. He would. And we, we already talked about it before the show. I'm like, Dushin, we're not yeah. doing that. We're no, not we talked that. about the X-Men. That's what I'm saying. Oh, that. Yeah. Uh, oh, just, oh. That's the question, because there, there's also <laughs> something else. <laughs> uh, uh, Zentron thought uh, when Joe was saying picks and vids, it was for his OnlyFans page. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine? Man. Imagine what someone wants to ask Joe to do and send send the video of him doing that. Like, <laughs> man. Joe, will you insert that hot dog in that one particular place? I, I really like that. And Joe's like, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, Joe, could you put that cucumber in, in your mouth again? Cucumber, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, man, I, don't know. I, I don't have the one image on my com computer anymore. Or watch Joe like eat like was it like a hot spider? Like, ah, 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 ah. You know, like, oh, did, I did remember not... that one. Yeah. What? what that, did, did you notice what what uh, what uh, Joe just said when about the cucumber? He said cucumber. Jesus Christ. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Mr. Slave. I I I wish I, I wish we could get Deuce laughing more because when he's trying to talk and he just starts giggling about yeah, like you, you, you can, you can because you start laughing. You can no, hear it's just, but yeah, and it's just like Deuce and I feel like was all, probably laughs the least, and yet he's starting to laugh a lot more. And it's like when you we get Joe Joe tickled and Joe just falls off his chair, like someone's over there tickling <laughs> Joe. And, <laughs> and when Deuce is trying to be serious and he just starts, you know, breaking character, like I, I it's. I remember yeah. the first already. time remember when he <laughs> laughed and I think James was on the episode we were like did he just laugh yeah, yeah James just never heard him laugh, laugh before yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean how could you when you're spending that amount of time working on Return of Faker and you're both yeah. just like I'm so fucking tired of and just being that. told by Amy it's like uh, nah yeah uh, or Universal, oh, excuse me, NBC Universal. Uh, so Philippe says the new Ultimate Spider-Man comic is solid. Issue two is dropping. I didn't know they were doing a whole all brand new after they they killed it off and brought Miles oh, also, Morales also, over to the. Also, which Spider-Man? Because there's like bajillion of them. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess. Yeah. Does he mean the one that brought back Peter Parker? But it's like Peter Parker as he's older. Or something. I thought that was one that was selling really well. I think. I, I, don't, I don't know if that's. I'm, right. I'm, 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 I don't know. Modern versions. <laughs> okay. I, I just. I, I. I can't support modern shit. I, I, uh, yeah, life Mar Story by Spider. Uh, a Spider-Man Life Story was the only like recent comic that I thought was really fucking brilliant. Other than that, it's it's been shitty. You know, crossovers and shitty artwork and shitty stories. It's just, and you get duped. You have eight dollars for this one issue. You're like, fuck this. Yeah, yeah, that's the that's the the harder pill to swallow. With that is the the price of comics just for oh one God. comic. How, and and not better, a variant of some kind. It's just the standard issue. You're better off just waiting until a bunch come out and they do a trade. 
Yeah, or yeah. or just wait till it comes out digitally on, on the apps. Yeah, yeah. yeah wait even, long enough, even you can get them all. On even digitally, when they sold them individually, it's still price seats, not like yeah. Oh yeah, well, it's not affordable. cheap. But what Tyler's saying is, if you wait long enough, then eventually they like if you're paying for the Marvel Marvel Unlimited app, after a period of time, those newer comics show up on the app, so you yeah. can just read them because you're paying. For if you're willing to wait, yeah, yeah. Ah. But, you know, yeah. But I'm like, fuck the new shit. I, I've tried it enough to where I'm like, I've, I'm like, I'm out. It, you're it, not getting my the money. I don't, price. What do they cost nowadays? Five bucks, six bucks, and that's just for like Jeez. a like a like a just a, your standard you know you know standalone issue. But just a basic, no shit. Yeah, Jesus. no, no. Um, that's just well, the, the the cover price. It, it's you know. I, well, I, Joe, I, how much was it when you were buying those shitty Master Universe comics that came out? Uh, two ninety nine, I think. Two ninety nine. Uh, yeah, hey, right. there's a Still there's too a. Much. a there's yeah. a variant uh, for the Thundercats issue one with metallic covers that costs like hundred dollars. That's, that's that's ridiculous. Dumb. That's dumb. Yeah, hundred dollars. And these people that buy comics like brand new and then immediately send them off to get graded, I'm like, what are you doing? Fucking morons. Yeah, there ain't gonna be no value in those. I'm no, sorry, modern comics. Like, do... I, I I can't see any any modern comics fetching legitimate money. You know. Graded or not, who the fuck would want to pay a CGC price for a modern comic that's been graded? I don't know. Yeah, I, I just why? I mean, why are why people... even grade them? Like they they brand new, literally. Like they didn't sit on a <laughs> shelf or anywhere or in a basement. It's brand new. There's no damage whatsoever. No, and I, I and I'm thinking like. You know, of course, I, I don't. I'm I'm out of the loop, so I can imagine this, but I still can imagine there's been a whole lot of key issues in Marvel and DC in the last 20 years that that justify paying 500 bucks I, for I an think, upgraded issue. I think maybe the only thing that would come close recently in terms of Marvel that immediately pops to mind is uh, Winter Soldier when they're doing when Brew Baker is doing Captain America. But that yeah, hurts. but even that, that's not. It's 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 it's, it's a key issue, but it's, it's not. Something it's reasonably that, enough priced. If you yeah. go to eBay and, and, and look it up, it's it's not bad. But um, even certain books from the nineties now, like 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 the second appearance of Venom, um, like second full appearance, yeah. that book goes for a hundred dollars minimum. Wow. You know, it's not a key issue, it's just his second appearance. It's an iconic Todd McFarlane cover, but you, you people are asking 150, 200 or more. Yeah. You know, ungraded. You know, and it's just it's just I think people like the artwork, which certain books, even from that time, like will still draw attention because people just love the artwork and the cover art, yeah. you know. But or, or like the, the the issue that McFarlane illustrated um, of a Hulk Wolverine with the famous cover of Wolverine with his claws, and then you see the reflection of, of Hulk and the claws. Like yeah. I think, yeah, that I, I got that book. I managed to get that. You know, I, I paid a fair amount, but that book has skyrocketed even more now. Yeah, of like, course, you know, ungraded. It's just. Certain certain books just you know they're not they're not a key issue. It's just people the like the cover and mm -hmm. and who and who or maybe like who worked on it or yeah and that's it. It's not like it's the first appearance or a death of a character or something like that. It's just a you know McF some of McFarlane's book books can just phew, just yeah. take off. Uh, Philippe had said here Daredevil has a key from 2016. The bad guy is going to be in the 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 new show, which I, I see how that would correlate and uh, jump. Up well, up. it just it just kind of makes you feel like well they're not actually going to do like a real born again, yeah. like like the Frank Miller storyline born again is just going to be what we're going to call that. Yeah, uh, I can't see Joe, but Joe hot dogs. Uh, Fedmon says here <laughs> thought, thoughts on the trend of grown up Happy Meals that some restaurants are thinking of doing. Example: McDonald's want to do the merch based on more grown up properties. Yeah, not it's not. Uh, I'm no, not. I'm not feeling it. I, well, I, like I think Tron last is, is year. Last ahead, year, I'll just for an example, I remember um, they were bringing back. I think it was Grimace and Hamburglar as figures. Like, oh, this would be cool shit. And then they all had four eyes and multiple. Yeah. shit. I was like, what the fuck is this? It's based yeah. off. Of, I don't even know what the fuck it was. Like, this is the dumbest shit I've ever seen. Yeah, it's like this, I'd rather if you're just gonna go, do them. Bring them. Uh, go ahead. Uh, no, uh, go ahead, Joe. Finish what you're saying there, bud. No, it's just like I said. If they're gonna do it, I mean, if they were gonna do stuff, at least at McDonald's of characters that we knew. 
Just bring them back, people. Fuck them. They're beloved, you know, beloved, whatever, the, how you ever say that word. But um, no, shit based off of stuff that you can just tell nobody gives a fuck about. But I mean, like, I will give it to like when McDonald's, uh, you know, back from the, you know, 2000 X figures for He-Man. You know, they did some cool little sculpts for He-Man, Skeletor. It's like, okay, now that's but, some cool looking shit. But, They're that, actually I, I, but that's that's different because the show was new and that's still a happy meal that's supposed to appeal to kids uh, well, yeah i don't like what, the growing up ones i mean i just i don't get the appeal i don't well, understand it not no, only there's, 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 they, they're always going to lack the charm of what we have it's not as nostalgia i just feel like there was a lot more originality go ahead nathan no to to piggyback off of that was it let I think they've done it the past couple of years, like around Halloween. They're like, "Oh, we're going to put out the the, the buckets, the buckets," but yeah. and they suck. They're they're not the same. Like it's no. not the exact. It, sure, right. like the bucket, the bucket itself has the face, but it doesn't even have a top on it. It has like this stupid little thing at the handle that that's supposed to mimic what the top was. I'm like, that's fucking remember, stupid. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, I don't get it. I don't get it. Yeah, they make it worse. Like, why don't they bring back the fucking glasses that we used to love? Remember all the character glasses and shit? Yeah. And when they promote, oh man. Yeah, or, man. Or, one, one of my favorite advertisements that McDonald's had was, you know, the, the moon that was saying about you know getting you know, oh, McKnight? McKnight. Yeah, Mac yeah. McKnight. McKnight. And I and they had Happy Meal toys of him. Yep. You know, Come there was on, one of him in the Jeep. Tonight. And, and those commercials yeah. of him like singing about get going to get McDonald's late at night. I they were fucking great love commercials. that. Yeah, and, and all and all the various lines they use, I mean, that were with popular. I mean, every month, like from Garfield to Muppet Babies, the Bernstein Bears movie tie-ins, you know, for ladies, you know, for Batman and things like that too. It was, and they don't do tie-ins for like none of the Marvel DC movies of McDonald's or Burger King. Like mm -hmm. you, you think as popular well, as those movies have been with kids that they would do glasses and cups and. And little figurines. They to do shit. Your well, they've done some shitty figures for some of the stuff from Marvel. They're terrible, but I just miss cool ass fucking glasses or the yeah. cups themselves or the ones that were like 3D raised glasses. I, man, they made damn. Well, they when made you some can cool get shit. VHS tapes at McDonald's. Too. Yeah, like Wayne's World and Adam's Family or Indiana Jones trilogy. My granddaddy got that for me for Christmas <laughs> from McDonald's. Man, that was awesome. Yeah. Oh well, here's one from Philippe uh, that we didn't mention: the Looney Tunes characters in the DC outfits. I love. I liked it back in the '90s. Yeah, I did too. Yeah, I, I thought that was a fun little McDonald's tie-in. I, I, I love that. I think now, uh, I'm sure it would work if they repurposed it and went for the nostalgia appealing to us. But I'm, I'm fucking sick of it. <laughs> like, well, I'm, I know we feel well that it's, because they're all, not... they're always half-assed. Yeah, the, well, yeah, they're never they gonna, target you know... it uh, to adults. It's like they feel like, well, the adults are just going to buy it. Like, adults that care about quality, they're just like, oh, I, I had that. And, and yeah. not, not as if, like, it they're not going to remember. Ground. Yeah, I just, I kind of feel like, you know, could you repurpose, like, the, or, or, or bring back the, the Looney Tune uh, DC times, of, like, the uh, Taz is the Flash, Daffy Duck is Batman, mm -hmm. Bugs is Superman, with brand new, awesome looking sculpts of them as these superheroes? Sure, you could, but. And it'd be, it could be done very well, but are they going to do it? Put that kind of quality like McDonald's used to do with their toys? No, probably not. Or, or they could even do it uh, as a generic superheroes. Like they don't need to represent any. No, yeah, if they just want heroes, then it just appeals to kids first do, and foremost. Or do the the um, like the Transformer esque things that they used to do? Yeah, like the like the the fr the, the box of fries or the uh, or the hamburger that would like nuggets. yeah yeah I got all of them. those were I awesome. Oh God, yeah, something like that again. Yeah, and the it was such a, yeah, it was such a simple gimmick, but God, like. And, or the McNuggets and in little costumes, like the yeah. little, little uh, the McFry well, kids. They, they, uh, I want to say when it came to the McNuggets thing, I do think recently they did something similar to that, where the McNuggets okay. were like characters. I don't think you could swap out outfits or anything. Yeah. But I think that they made McNugget characters, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, well, it it just was a testament too that you know back then, man, that McDonald's realized the Happy Meal, and plus same thing went for Burger King and Wendy's. Happy Meals were big business back then. I mean, getting yeah. getting those little tie-ins of like little books or action figures yeah. or glasses that that kids would just beg. To, I mean, we we were all guilty of that, and it was a blast because you didn't know which one you were going to get. That's look what they at did that. Recently. Okay, well, yeah, so that, 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 those aren't bad. They're, They're not, not bad at all. No, and it does look like uh, swappable parts. On yeah, it does. So I mean, uh, there's that, but at the same time, I. I I'm tired of them relying on 
on us. Like now, now that we are older, we're we're like that generation. It's like, oh, okay, well, we're we're gonna buy shit up like that because that's that's carried over for a lot of us since our childhood. We're yeah. still collecting things, and I don't know. I, I'm just I'm getting I'm getting tired of it. That's well, true. plus I'd rather just go on eBay and buy the ones that we had when we were kids. If you don't have them, like I'd rather go and buy an original Bernstein Bear set of all four or the Muppet of- Babies. Which I've got those, yeah. Yeah, and I got Nathan those too. I think one yeah. year, I think I got in the Muppet Babies. Yeah, and the um, I mean, they did real Ghostbusters. Mm-hmm. Uh, Thundercast was at Burger King. Silverhawks was at Burger King. Turtles was at Burger King. Like yeah, you know, they got a lot of the turtle stuff from Burger King. Yeah, have that. Yeah, Last Action Hero cups were at Burger King. The, the Batman Forever cups. Of, what uh, what would have been? Kind of the I remember Lord of the Rings had the glasses at Burger King, and I, yeah, I think I, I they, got those things. They'd light yeah, up. We, yeah, they lit up at the bottom. Yeah. Was yep. it? Uh, was it the first J. J. Abrams Star Trek movie? Did that also? Oh, I don't know about that. I didn't collect I, that. I, you know, it kind of think. I think there was some sort of like I, I tie think in, but something, I, right? Yeah, Did, but I, didn't I, KFC have have a tie into original Star Trek? Like really? the, there was also there was like a commercial that, where they had like look like actors. Yeah, that mm-hmm. one I don't because I, I never associate KFC with having any like fast food uh, kid or t- like uh, uh, tie-ins or anything like that. Nineteen ninety-five, actually. No kidding. God, li- listen to Deucen's like fucking old ass keyboard over there. Con, 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 con. <laughs> <laughs> Ting. Did no, no, you right. borrow it from Joe or something? <laughs> Bastard. It's a Logitech Plus. keyboard. But like yeah, we'll, we'll we'll never see a resurgence of like kids crazy about the Happy Meals the way no, that we were. I, It'll I never yeah, happen I, I, again. I, I, I don't think so either. Hell, when McDonald's would do like the 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 Barbie stuff for girls and the Hot Wheels for boys. Yeah, like it, you know. And they just would ask, you know. Now they they find it offensive, like just you know, just whatever. But but even that was like a fun little tie-in, like you know, to get what kind of Hot Wheel you're going to get. I'm sure the, the girls. I never talked to a girl who. Got those, so or, you know, or, or wanted them. It seemed like girls didn't give a shit about Happy Meals. Probably not. Yeah, we should ask Rebecca because Rebecca would have been old enough, at least you know, to, to you know, for some of the nineties, like Happy Emily, Meals. Get in here. Do you yeah. like Happy Meals? <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, just knowing that that McDonald's and Burger King were really like buying up rights left and right mm-hmm. to 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 put in four or five different. For you know Disney movie tie-ins like the that, Little Mermaid had had that little. That was the uh, figures. biggest thing when when that swapped, didn't it? It went from McDonald's to to Burger King, right? Because McDonald's was like, oh, we're not going to worry about it anymore, and Burger King snatched it up, and that's kind of when there was also that little bit more of the resurgence with uh, the the mid to late '90s Disney properties. Like McDonald's had it when it was uh, what like your your Lion Kings and Little Mermaids, but then Burger King took it over. And it was more like the like your Lilo and Stitches and the Pixar. The yeah, early but McDonald's Pixar. Oh yeah, yeah, because they had Toy doing... Story. Yeah, they had yeah, Toy Story, which I, I remember that that was big because they had the puppets, they had the hand puppets. I'm and which, I missed we, we had I missed that stuff too. Like the you remember the Eureka's Castle puppets uh, from Pizza Hut? I uh, vaguely. Those are pretty solid. And I think they I did Land McDonald's. Before Time, La- which I had the Land Before Time was I had all of them. Yeah, because uh, yeah. my mom mom didn't mind helping out and, and helped me get all those. When Go those ahead, they do have uh, they do have uh, Disney back though with McDonald's. I mean, they've been doing like they had the hundred years of Disney where there was a hundred yeah. different little mini figures, all this stuff. But <laughs> I mean, they, no, I'm just saying they are doing I that again. I, I think the last thing I got that I really enjoyed at a place was Burger King was when the Simpsons had their playmates figures that came out and the yeah. figures were really hot. They started doing every Halloween Treehouse of horror themed ones. And they did oh. it for like three years straight. And damn, I just, I had a big collection of those and they were actually quality. They would make sounds. Yeah. They would light up. They which, would do something. It which is cool. surprising because it's playmates and playmates is kind of known for being like cheap, being cheap. but, but uh, to their credit, Outside of original turtles, their Simpsons line when it came out, it, it really it, was good. fucking good. It because we were addicted to buying those for a couple of years. I, I mean, kind of we wanted, wanted to get the, the Bret Hart one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, Joe talking about Simpsons and, and Burger King. I remember when the, yeah. the show first got really hot and they had the the, oh. the dolls. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I, I'm pretty sure I got all of those at the time. Wait a second, Joe watched the Simpsons. 
Yeah, why wouldn't I? I because uh, you're old. <laughs> well, thanks. I got there. Well, I, I think it, I think Joe was watching The Simpsons because Married with Children pulled him in first, and he was waiting to watch that. And The Simpsons would go, like maybe he would catch like a rerun or something. But, oh, okay, this show's okay. Well, Joe probably saw them so, on the so, Tracy Ullman show first. Yeah, I, I did. Not I true. did. I remember the, the 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 little sketches, and then bam, then it became its own show. And yeah, uh, so, I, yeah. So, I so basically, so basically, you're saying that we could do episode commentaries from The Simpsons. Yeah. Not, All right. Not, well, I, hey, I, think, uh, I think Simpsons. Wait, hang on, Joe. Uh, don't forget okay. about the Taco Bell. Uh, Batman yeah, Cups. that, and he also did Batman and Robin too. Yeah. Taco Bell did, yeah. But, Which then, I really wanted the Mister Freeze cup. I never did get a hold of that one. Yeah, I got the uh, the McDonald's Batman Returns cups. Oh, those were all. I still would like to have I, a whole set of those. Because the the dude the the, the art on that is it's amazing, amazing. Yeah. unbelievable. I only got yeah, one as a kid. It was the one of of Selena and Michael Keaton dancing, and I, I really wanted to, like just. The, uh, the cups of like them as as character like in their in their costumes like I that's the ones that I want and the little frisbee top and of course yeah. yes that's coming out yeah the piece yeah. Yeah, yeah got yeah got the uh, the the audio cassette and would listen to that all the time that's cool well, as shit yeah yeah Joe's itching to get out of here so let's go ahead and wrap her up no but hey the, like I said <laughs> well, you I'm anyway not, but, uh, I'm but no, no, if you give me the green line I guess I might as well. <laughs> Yeah, I can't point, but if you guys are new to this channel, make sure you like, subscribe, share, and ring that bell so you can always be notified when we go live. And until next time, have a powerful day. You got to point My at queen. the screen, Nathan. Oh, oh. See, see, look at that. See, this is what botches. Like, you know, we, we go had this formula. Come on, go ahead, go ahead Tyler. <laughs> you know? Okay, well, you know what? I'm going to do a different one since I, I got interrupted on the other one. You know what I mean, Ralph? Fuck you, because it makes me feel yeah. good. Yeah, I I did think about that one. Oh, uh, yeah, one. I figured you would. <laughs> all right, go ahead. But, uh, all right. And what's with that stupid grin? Life's been good to me. Oh. Uh, Batman! Right. Th yeah. Joe, uh, Batman, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Batman, yeah. <laughs> Why did you yell oh. at me, Deuce? You said Joe! Oh, yeah. Well, like, uh, hey, uh, don't don't act like oh, it's so easy, because no, I recorded Batman say... Returns last night. The whole fucking scene, Nathan's like, uh, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, what, what did you say, Joker? What's that? What I was, was gonna say, Joker. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Who's Joker? talking? <laughs> We're all yeah, Tyler. What was the Batman uh, Returns quote that you did last night? You said oh. that Nathan couldn't get. Oh well, I damn, I started with one quote, and then I did the whole fucking scene. He still. <laughs> I already told you, Batman Returns for me as many times as I watch it. I. I the, it, that well, I'm sure it, I would have botched it. it. I just want to hear it. I just want to hear what it okay. was to see if maybe. But hey, Joe, what, maybe you just go fucking watch the episode. How about that? I just want to hear it. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> You're the, he don't, don't want to watch the episode. No, he does. Let him go. go. I will that watch. Was, it's that, still a goddamn court. <laughs> that would require effort, like going to the post office. Yeah. Right, good. <laughs> yeah. All right. You don't really think you'll win, do you? Oh my Thanks. god, you didn't know that was the penguin? No, fuck, yeah, fuck off, Joe. Like, you would have got it on the spot. <laughs> I do. I, everybody everybody no. knows that fucking oh, everybody quote. Everybody knows it, sure. Well, hey, Joe, hey, Joe, 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 would you like to do a Batman Returns commentary with us? Sure. Oh, yeah, I was right. waiting for a second. Oh, yeah, no, right. I, I think I'm going to be sick that week. Yeah, right. Yeah, you remember right. that would say you, the video you, game, you know, too, anytime when you'd lose and the penguin would say that, too. You know, it's like, oh, my God, I can't believe Nathan didn't know that. All right. Uh, the I love only you, Jenny. Joe thing, knows it is, is because it's the on a video is, game. That's the no, only reason. I, no, the, no, the real I, reason is that he identifies with the penguin. <laughs> oh, don't he, you do it? He has the same in the skin tone, same looks. <laughs> and, when, uh -huh. and Joe, when he gets really hungry, I just need a bite. He falls down on his ass, just like the penguin does. Uh, <laughs> Goddamn! See you guys next week. Yeah, yeah, Joe wouldn't have got it. He wouldn't have oh, got they're it. Not gonna, they're not going to see you if you're if you're still audio only. Yeah, I'll throw I'll throw another another uh, another reference in, in, for all three of you guys. All right, your interest was good. His was better. Uh, that was uh, uh, for when Batman came in. Um, uh, shit, shit. Uh, what part? Wait, wait. Damn Batman, it. Say it again. Say it. Batman, Batman took shit. <laughs> no, say it again. Say it again, Tyler. <laughs> say it again. Say, say, it, again. say it again. Say it again. Tyler. That's lovely. Hey, hey. <laughs> Your interest was good. His was better. Was that what the Riddler said, or was it Two Face said it? To God damn it! I can't remember. That, what sound, was it. that sounds like a Riddler quote to me. God damn it. Or come on, people, give me a final answer. Come on, it, come on Joe. Apparently, it's so fucking easy. 
because they they turned Two Face into a yuck fest, which I didn't like. Oh, I know it um, fucking sucked. I'm gonna say Two Face just because. Yeah, fuck it. I'll say Two Face. No. It and it was joke. It, 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 it was Riddler. It was really talking to Two Face. I was right though. I was right though. No, I knew I was close. No, hey, I said it before you said it. God damn it! I love you, Jenny. I'm glad no one can see you right now. Yeah. yeah. He's probably kissing something else. <laughs> <laughs> or someone else. Yeah, probably. He's probably kissing Rick Poe she... attached to his bed. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Hey, wait, hang on. Let, let, if we're all quiet enough, let's see if we can hear Rick's... Uh... Rick, Rick, if you can hear us, you know, just, just scream out loud. We'll, we'll try have to, the, uh, try to authority. Try to be as loud as you... Muffle as loud as you can for us. All right, what, what, what's that? It puts the lotion on its skin or else it gets the hose again? Is that what you said, Rick? Yeah, Joe, what's that from? <laughs> Joe's like, put the fucking lotion in the basket. <laughs> yeah, what's that from, Joe? Science of the Lambs. <laughs> hey, he's on a roll tonight. <laughs> he didn't have to think about that one. Well, uh, you know, as many times as he's oh, oh, wait, we're sure oh, we're that girl. and pattern his life after it. Yeah. See you guys. Goodbye. Later. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, my Joe does that too. Like, tucks it in. Yeah, tucks it in. <laughs> tucks it in and shimmies in front of them. 